Hi. Oh, wait. I gotta get rid of this. There we go. I've gotten rid of the mic, so now I'm using the computer mic. Hope you guys can hear me. Alright. Setting up, getting everything ready. We have the game running this time, so it's not going to take 15 minutes to load up. I uh, gotta tweet out all the stuff. Oh, god damn it. There we go. Go in here. Let's see this. Enter here. Enter here. I gotta port it out to everywhere that I post it. <laughs> Alright. I'm just waiting for my brother to get in here and then we will start. Okay. You here? Yeah. Alright. Um, okay, I think we are all set. Uh, okay, you can say hi, people. <laughs> yeah. Uh, nobody's here right now. God, this is, this is why I need that picture so that we can build a... What? It, <laughs> it takes a while. So yeah, that's the thing. The the we don't see it, um, but it like it does it doesn't update instantly. It takes like sometimes up to a minute before it actually shows up as somebody somebody's here. So that's why you should always talk as people are here, even if they're not, because you might not see it. <laughs> cool. Um, but yeah, uh, so that's why I really wanted that that stream starting, so I could just let it run for a couple minutes so people can trickle in. That's that's what people. So the first set is not just dead time, like where I'm just talking to. Every, it's not just completely wasted where everybody misses it. Because even if people do want it, they don't have instant reflexes to always, or or just they don't have access to always just get on. Right. Yeah. So I'm going to be getting an image soon. My friend David is being awesome and actually was working on it as a Christmas present for me, and he's he's doing it. He's got a really nice image. Thanks, David. Uh, again. Uh, if you're watching this on the VOD, this is my brother, Bone Meta, <laughs> and he's uh, he's also on YouTube and does a podcast uh, called The Billion Dollar Movie Club. Put it in right here. You know, it'll be. You can look it up on YouTube. That's the name of the channel. As well as uh, on Apple Apple Podcasts and Spotify. Oh, Spotify yeah. yeah, so give it a look, check it out, put out weekly video, weekly podcast. So, thank. Uh, we have everything set up. I got food this time. If I if I'm hungry, I got a pop tart. More. We got pretzels down there. I'm probably gonna be snacking on a bunch of those in the middle of this thing. So who knows? Maybe we'll finish the entire bucket. I really <laughs> hope not. Cause that's seven dollars of pretzels for free in there. Like, okay. But um, I'm gonna take just a breath. Let's get get calm. Do this, and uh, I guess start the episode. Yeah. Cool. All right, episode four. Yes. Two more days of this. <laughs> and then we will end the year with Final Fantasy 7. And then we will start the year with and, Final Fantasy 7. <laughs> and he'll be done with it. Yeah, sure. <laughs> all, of, all of a sudden I'll just transport eight chapters ahead and yeah. finish the game. Yeah, I wish. <laughs> I mean, I... Are I'm you not enjoying your time? With this, it? Oh, you know, I, that's what I was gonna say. I was like, no, I, I am enjoying it. I'm enjoying bits. I will say, as a whole, probably prefer the original. Even even just comparing this segment, not comparing anything else, I prefer it because it doesn't have bloat. There there are entire chapters of filler. 
in this thing. Mm. Where, like, which I get why they did it. I'm not talking about Life is Strange. I'm talking about Final Fantasy VII, uh, the, the remake, uh, which I completely understand why they did it because they had to expand it. But, like, so we didn't is it need a filler film. because it's stuff that they added that wasn't in the original material, or like, or is it filler because it doesn't even add on to what they did add plot wise? Thanks for the follow. <laughs> oh my God! Hi, Sac- Sacrox. Thank you for the follow. Thank you for be- joining us so quickly. <laughs> uh, that's awesome. Uh, you know, what, let's talk about this one for now first, and then I'll talk about when when this is not going on right now. So, the little one had another freaking panic attack. We just finished Life is Strange episode three yesterday. This is just jumping through all the stuff that yeah, happened in the first first three episodes. Yeah. Well, this was all first episode. No, it isn't. Wasn't that? No, that was the beginning of the yeah. second, right? That was the beginning of the second. The brothers made it to the home. Yeah, and that was the grandparents. The old they stayed there for a bit, then they had to leave, and the cops came. The hunters were hot on the trail. And then it goes to episode three. That's about. Well, that was the end of two. So they decided. Keep going south. And now it's three. Now here's the recap of three. They soon entered the old forest of the giants, where they met a pack of stray dogs who were <laughs> a pot farm. <laughs> the brothers joined <laughs> and worked hard to stock up on gold. Damn, those wolves would get high as fuck. <laughs> <laughs> well, you don't know. So not everybody can handle it that way. Is there a weasel? So there's a couple dogs, there's a weasel. I mean, if they're moving it by just sticking it in their mouth. <laughs> no, but they, they some digest it differently. Like, I think that that's how, like, for us, if we eat eucalyptus, it's nothing. Or it's even partly medicinal. Koalas are, like, high as fuck all the time because that's all they eat and it, it, it makes them high. <laughs> Well, yeah, because it's not suddenly you shot the you tried to steal from him. The big brother was bad with glass in his eye. Wonder if he's gonna be blinded. He didn't know where the little cup was. Okay. Oh, it's going to start late. Yeah. If you want to continue that conversation on this thing, I can, but I don't know. Yeah, go ahead. Uh, I mean, I don't... It, like, so... For instance, all this, there's a whole bunch of side quests and dealing with the town of mm-hmm. the people under... That's not too bad. I get it. They're trying to humanize the people under the thing, uh, under the plate, and make you give sh- more of a shit for that. It doesn't fully work, and I know for a fact, because based on what happens later, that they undercut the emotional impact of what happens afterwards because of this, because of the other stuff that they added during the thing. So it actually makes the, the thing less of a tragedy. Um, the next thing that's there was they turned things that they made getting from point A to point B, which was literally one screen that you run through in the game into an entire chapter. Like, going when they went to blow up the second reactor, uh, it was just, you know, you go to the reactor and you're immediately inside, right? Now, they get... They, after, uh, it was from jumping off the train and then you get into yeah. the reactor. Now, after you jump on the train, there's a whole section where you're under the reactor going from... just going to get into the reactor that took me an hour and a half. When you try to stop me from going with of me. like nothing. Who's too It's okay. The the dude. segment that you were stuck on when you were in like that graveyard, like when you were ch- taking Aerith to the Yeah. Yeah. That's not like So that took me an hour just to get from her house to the playground. I mean it took me an hour too. <laughs> I mean that's because you got you didn't know you could climb up this one thing. <laughs> but like they made a whole bunch of extra scenes and that and like the whole thing with Don Corny. I mean, some bits are fun, like the rhythm game they added in, just like out of nowhere to get the dress just now. But like, 
Please. There's a, there's Please. just a lot of yes. filler I that swear. serves no purpose. Stop. Okay. So now he's in the hospital. <laughs> hospital. I mean, they're, they're in California. No. no. So it's the hospital. Hospital. <laughs> Two months? Oh, wow. Do they not know who he is? Fuck. Daniel. So in a coma for weeks, in police custody, going to jail soon. Okay, so he is going to jail. Tried to draw to kill time, it's really like cage, but I suck now. No depth perception, no art, no shit. Focusing equals immediate migraine, going crazy in here, woke up crying. Special secret agent Flora, she's trying to bottom me, trap me, or trust me. Fuck. Can't, cops can't find Daniel after explosion, so he's out there alone. Happy birthday, Daniel, wherever you are. So it's April 11th. Or April 15th. Okay, Claire and Steven sent a nice letter. So lonely, I read it twice. Weird how I missed them now. So cool to hear from Captain Spirit, too. Glad he's doing fine. My Joey sketch doesn't look bad, so glad he's around. Who's Joey? I fucked Daniel up. I let Finn become his brother. Yeah. You can try and draw. Let's see what happens. Look up. Yeah, you can only see from a half ear. Probably out the window. Check the other side. Oh, no. Okay, let's see how it... I mean, that's still... Even just... It's so hard to focus. Gotta practice way more. And that's what abstract art is for. <laughs> Look up again. I guess that's an okay start. Yes, and get the whole hard lines in. Damn, that's pretty good. Yeah, I know. That's way. That's better than I can do now. And he's just like, yeah, I got this. <laughs> I'm so terrible. Draw prison bars or draw a staircase. Draw a staircase. You just gotta look out the window. Staircase to heaven, I guess. Come on, man. My masterpiece. <laughs> I did it. Yeah. <laughs> I did it. Because <laughs> he's missing an eye. <laughs> yes, I know it's bad. <laughs> Check out the TV, I guess. What, the black screen is a reality show? It is. <laughs> yeah, because it's a mirror. So it's a reality. <laughs> it shows reality, get it? It's a reality show! <laughs> what do you say, just screw the thing? Yeah. It's the deepest shit I've ever seen. I'm glad the cops didn't mess with them, too. Cops and doctors won't tell me anything about what's going on with you and Finn, except that you were injured in police custody. That's how I got the hospital name. They interviewed and interrogated me, Hannah, and Penny, and let us go. Both of you weren't so lucky, I guess, or maybe you earned it. Yeah, because she's she's pissed because Bowen. Hey, Melody. Hello. How are you doing? Bowen's just in the, now. We're just, we're just in the hospital after we tried to rob a pot farmer and got blown to shit because of the psychic abilities of the little brother who's now missing. That that's a quick recap <laughs> of like what just happened in the last episode. So. <laughs> I hope you are okay after what happened. You probably know more about what's going on than me, but Hannah, Penny, and I were released without charges. The police were stoked to bust a farm of drug traffickers rather than us poor gutter punks toiling in the field. We asked about you and Daniel, but no answer is surprise. So with Finn and you gone, our rail family's kind of broken up. Now we're just a lonely trio train hopping up and down the state, but it feels like we're gone in a loop to nowhere. Hannah and Penny aren't the same, and we fight too much. I'm not even sure we'll be together for much longer. Shit changes, right? I hope you're going to trial soon over... I know that you're going to trial soon over the Seattle situation and hope you will get some form of justice. I hope you and Daniel will find your way home soon. Peace, Cassidy. Okay. So, to answer your questions, Mel, can you pause it? 
Just really quick. So to answer your questions, we are fine. <laughs> we're good. Uh, we're fine. Uh, if you want, this game is uh, so. Lo- this is Life is Strange Two, um, made by Don't Nod. Basically, uh, it's a sequel to Life Life is Strange One, but they're not really connected. They just take place in the same universe. Yeah. Uh, basically, what start out is you're you play as a Mexican. Uh, a uh, Mexican American who was living in Seattle, and literally the thing starts off like you're trying to go to a party, and then your brother angers the neighbor kid, and then you and him get into a fight. A, a cop comes, the dad, your dad tries to de-escalate the situation, and he gets shot. And then your brother cre- gets psychic powers and blows up the place. Well, the cop ends up dead, and you, in a panic, pick him up and just start running, and then you go on the run, and that's the first episode. Second episode, you end up with the parent, the grandparents, and you hide out there for a bit, and then you had to start running again because the cops find you. The third episode, which is where we were, is you end up at a pot farm, work there for a bit, and then one of the people finds out about your brother's powers and decides to start um, try to steal from the guy. That does not go well, and the brother again has a panic attack or like he ex- he explodes again, and then. He- you wake up in a coma now, two months later, the and the other, the brother is gone. So we, we don't know where the brother is, and that's basically where we started so far. Right. Uh, I think I've done about all I can. Wait, wait. There we go. Pat Stevens, like it's better. Sean, we are grateful to find out that you are safe and awake. So this is the grandfather. Acted us when you were found unconscious in Humboldt County. We weren't allowed to visit you in the hospital, but we want you to recover ASAP. The doctors say that you woke up from that coma stronger than before. So now he has powers too, apparently. No worries, my love. <laughs> <laughs> uh, the most important thing now is to find Daniel. We are helping the police any way we can. They really want to help find him too, Sean. Hopefully this reflects well during your trial. We know this must be hard for you after everything you and your brother have been through. You're both in our thoughts and prayers every day and night. Remember, you are family and we love you. We hope you. Vi- we hope to visit you and Jolina Shore as soon as we can. P.S. Chris insisted to write a little note that's attached to this. So Chris is... Um, so this game was... This was an episodic game uh, released in five parts. Uh, we're, we're on episode four right now. And actually, right before the game was released, they released a um, like a demo to get you to, to let you get more of a feel of this game that was free. That was about Chris, which is called the Event Awesome Adventures of Captain Spirit. I actually we actually played that first. Uh, so he's he's there. He's just another character, like another kid that was basically next door to the grandparents. They talked, and he knows about Daniel's psychic powers now. He doesn't know Daniel is missing. He yeah, he just doesn't know he's missing. Yeah. Nice Hi Sean and Daniel, I hope you are okay. I am fine, but I miss both of you a lot. <laughs> when are you coming back? Dad has our, has been better lately. He says hello, and we are fishing now that summer is here. We do a lot of stuff outside now. All the snow is gone. You should come back to see Beaver Creek without the snow. I'll, we'll be waiting for you, Chris and Captain Spirit. So that's good because he the in in the in the demo like basically you, you get the impression that dad is an alcoholic who probably beats his kid, and so it, so the fact that it's going a little better is, is definitely a good sign. And you you definitely you interact with the dad. And you have options of how to do it. But one basically just ignored the situation as much as he could. Uh, so we don't know how much of this is not how much of it has actually been fixed. <laughs> hey. Stupid reality Am I supposed to do something to? I don't know. Work? Look around. Look around. What else is that called? There you go. I guess you're supposed to call the nurse. Oh, I should. I have the walkthrough. I could. Hey, David. Hey. I got. I forgot. I have it here. Yeah. Hmm. Well, I pressed it. Yeah, he'll be coming. It, it's a nurse call button. It takes a while for the nurse to get here. I love pretzel rods because I always like pretending it's a cigar, and I'm, that's how I always eat it. I don't know. That's a huge ass cigar. Yeah, yeah I know. <laughs> it, well, it's actually a lot skinnier than most cigars. I think <laughs> cigars are usually a little thicker. But I think you should like eat off the tip so that it's like you know when you cut it. I know, but then I, but then I have to hold it like this. I don't want it. I like to just eat it from one side. There we go. <laughs> Good day, sunshine. 
Hey, Joey. Hooray, more food. Right. I think it's medicine. Yeah. Hey, man. <laughs> that looks like it might have been food. <laughs> <laughs> Hard to tell. Aha. <laughs> uh -huh. Never heard that before. Oh, somebody is in a bad mood. Sorry, Joey. Not feeling it today. Mm. <laughs> I don't blame you. This is also a game where nobody <laughs> looks. You ninety percent of the time when they're having a conversation, they don't look each other in the eyes. <laughs> that smile. Thanks, Joey. So how you feeling today? <laughs> Any headaches? Socket pain. Socket pain. Yeah, because no. so last episode he had the explosion where like basically his it's eyes gone now. Before. And so the he's going. He, the cops are basically finding him. Yeah. Yeah. <clears throat> okay. Let's see. You know the drill. Don't blink and just stare <laughs> at the light. All right. Let's stare into the light with our one good eye. <laughs> yes. Nice retina response. Okay. Now. Try to. Find are you actually gonna have to do anything? Or oh, you are. Come on, Sean. You've been there before. Good, good. Keep going. So you know, I never understood. Quick response. Like, are you actually supposed to move your head when this kind of thing happens, or are you just supposed to follow with your eyes? To see objects on your left side, you gotta turn your head more now. Yes. Like for real, like good, Sean. for real, because like I would figure you, it would actually be better to. Uh, I'll try. No rush. This is tough. Nope. Your depth perception will always be affected. So you gotta try harder. Oh, shit. It's just, it's just, uh, depth. So it's forward and back. Yeah, I know. It's hard. Oh, come on. Nope. Too far. Yeah, that's... Yeah, it's not working. <laughs> too much depth on you and your eye. But remember, your depth perception will always be affected. Hmm. Here, read this. Huh. Hooray. <laughs> I'm a pirate. I'm a pirate. I'm a pirate. I'd be more worried if you're smart ass. You can try, but you can't rig the exam, Sean. It's time we release you. Sorry. Your vision has improved a lot. Now you don't really have severe side effects anymore. You think he's gonna de develop uh, the superpowers too? True. Yeah, and he's gonna break out of jail. Let's clean this dress. Hey. And lead the superpowered uprising against the normal people. What do you think this is infamous first light or whatever, second sun or whatever the hell? Second sun, that was one, right? Nah, that's see. I'm saying what's gonna happen in uh, Do you mind if we talk alone? Life is Strange Life is Three. My he looks good for now, right? Mm. Come back when I'm finished with him. Max, Sean, and Daniel are gonna meet up, and they're. Gonna I have an assumption she found the the brother. That's why she's like telling him, like I didn't talk to you now. I'll swing by later, Sean. Stay cool. <laughs> it's probably because it's something urgent, so I, I assume. And I assume that's the, she's the lady that gave the card. Yeah. I mean, you can see her badge. Yeah, well, I, uh, that, that, that means to be any cop, but I, I just assume, so, you know. How are you feeling? You don't give names yeah. without a. Uh, Amazing. Did you find Daniel? I want to go over this again. What? I've been telling the same fucking story for three weeks. How much longer? Until it makes sense. Until you get it right. So, silence isn't gonna help you now. Listen close, Sean. Tomorrow you're going to Jolina Shore and you'll be arranged. Yeah, I got court. that. For the murder of a Seattle police officer. You might spend the rest of your life in prison. But you can talk to me. I'm innocent until proven guilty. Right? And I believe <laughs> that. That's why I want you to tell me the whole truth. It's just can't. Daniel involved. Is that why you can't talk? No, no way. And you're absolutely sure your dad didn't go after the officer. Yeah, 
He came outside, then he was killed. That's what he did. Just guilty of being Mexican. <laughs> I hear you, but you sure you didn't get upset and go after the officer? It happens. Jesus. No. Oh. Look at me. Okay, let's just jump in. Okay. Is it gonna go through all of the and actions? Oh no, just the action farmer home. home. Okay. The place looks like a tornado wiped it out. There was a mini tornado <laughs> in the room. I have no clue why the place. Was okay, bad. so he's still hiding the powers. I passed out. Plus two seriously wounded, along with you. And. All right. Yeah, missing chop. The only statement. Wait, has Finn has was. Finn's dead. Sean. Oh, they're ser seriously injured, so maybe they Tell haven't necessarily won't. woken up yet. Can't you see I want to help? So you haven't found my brother? We might have some leads. You can help by telling the truth. Uh, he was gone when I woke up. <laughs> what else do you want me to say? I don't know where he went. The robbery. Whose idea was it? His? Or yours? Huh? You gonna sell out Finn? I mean, I agreed. We all did. Nero totally ripped us off. Not a good guy. That's what hmm. happens when you mess with drug traffickers. <laughs> Do you think I had a fucking choice? That's the only job I could get. Why didn't you try to get help? Go to the police. <laughs> oh, yeah. Yeah, hey, after I'm a <laughs> suspected cop killer. <laughs> my dad and accused us of murder. <laughs> So Finn wanted to get revenge on Meryl too. Your friend is learning the hard way. I didn't deserve it. We all make mistakes. Yeah. Well, some mistakes are like, worth. I'm surprised you're taking the bullet. You're you're taking the bullet for Finn. <laughs> we contacted your grandparents in Beaver Creek. They can visit you after like, you I would have I would have said to say was the idea. Because <laughs> it was. You have a support group. But I also probably wouldn't have <laughs> gone to on to the thing, so. Sorry. Good. But you're the one in the control, that's why I have like, I said might. Unless you tell me, I'm not going to influence suggestions. <laughs> Listen. It's a commune. Pictures. You gotta you gotta be the group. Sorry, Finn. At least Cassie. Lucy Rose. Okay, so her name's not Cassie. It's Lucy Rose Jones. There's Jonathan Merrill. Merrill told the cops about the robbery. Hannah. Sorry, Hannah. Hope the cops didn't mess with well. Baptist Dean Baptiste. Baptiste. Well, there's no E. That. Baptist isn't. Oh, I mean, isn't that a like a clergy rank? Maybe, but like, it doesn't seem like he was that kind of dude. Well, maybe they just named him that way. People named Priest. <laughs> do people do are you named, know anybody? People are named priest? Daenerys. <laughs> <laughs> Game of Thrones was a mistake. <laughs> <laughs> that no one acknowledges exists anymore. <laughs> I don't think there's anything else to look at. You want me to look up what yeah. to do? And uh, she'll just come back to the room and finish the conversation. You've basically done everything. Uh, you never looked at the ball, did you? I did. Oh, okay. Oh, yeah, it was. It said, like, you just can't catch any shit. <laughs> That's what it was, okay. So, what's going on with Danny? You really have leads? Yes, we do. <laughs> yeah, <job>. shit. <laughs> put his profile Wait, this is the F she's the FBI? So, we are on the team. <laughs> For how long? It's been over two months. How are you gonna find him? We have a lot of people looking for your brother. Trust me. I, I guess maybe because it's a cop killer, it, like, and it's like supposed yeah. cop killer, and it's across state lines, so it'd have to be in a national agency. Anyway. So I guess FBI. Thanks for talking to me. Yeah. I'll be back tomorrow to take you to Jolina Shore. Feels odd, but yeah, it makes sense. I mean, you definitely wouldn't be CIA. Oh, CIA is spies, not... <laughs> they're also not supposed to work on American soil. Of course they do, but that's beside the point. Like...
Okay, so yeah. Look out! I have to guard the car <laughs> now. <laughs> Love it. Sit down so we can get this show going. So okay. What psyche now or something? Uh, I don't think so. I think he's just. You mean interrogation? <laughs> Who knows? Maybe Detective Clark <laughs> wants to help. Her. Yeah, maybe. Maybe not. I just can't trust you. After what you and your brother went through, I don't blame you. Oh, this shit is all wrong, man. You've been out of the garden for three weeks now. We talk every day. I can see that you're a good person. Out of the garden? What does that mean? He said I can see you're a good person. Yeah, that's what I heard that much. Okay. Thanks, Joey. Wanna tell you I'm just saying. I don't deserve it. I think it's more uh, is checking out your eye patch. The healing is coming along nice. Just gotta keep it clean. Are those just like watermelons outside or something? Simple. That's great. Seen the shrink this morning? What did she say? Nothing I want to hear. This will take time. <laughs> no shit. <laughs> I can tell myself that shit. Clearly, I'm no therapist, but I've nursed patients with your injury. They all turned their anger into energy. You will Oh, I guess he's giving eye drops or something. Plus, the glass eye tech. <laughs> glass eye tech. <laughs> Things change, huh? <laughs> yeah. Stuck in jail is a big change. And wait. Please. Sorry, Joey. I'm being a dickhead. Just bummed out. <laughs> yeah, I know. I'm just feeling like I'm just realistic. I'm a Mexican in here who's being threatened, who's being said that I sh killed a cop. Like, I'm not probably gonna get a lot of sympathy or anything. <laughs> like, one or the other is already hard enough. You get both, you're kind of screwed in this country. And I think that's, I mean, that's definitely part of the point this game wants to make. Yeah. Um, like, this game was made in 2018 set in 2017 well it was released in 2018 obviously it was made and set in during 2017 uh, so you know everything that's going on now was still going on like they understood that they were making they were making the point with who they cast how they made this game and what it is you gotta do this it's you can't take away the politics out of this game because that's it's intrinsic to its main story I'm sorry about everything Sean wish I could have done more dude you saved hmm. my ass here. You're the only one I trust. It really helped. Cool. I'm glad when I can make a change. Uh oh. Oh shit. Emergency. Gotta go. I'm out. And no <laughs> break. Let's say our goodbye tomorrow. Oh, Sean, check out that towel. Got your name all over it. Daniel's hidden in the towel. Okay. First, uh. By your drawing, there's something. Joey. Joey's the only one who helped me get through this shit. Okay. Okay, and then the checking out that towel will end the thing. Alright, so there we go. There's the optional collectible. Oh, your journal! I haven't seen you in a long time. So, wait, but we didn't in the journal... So was he hiding it from her? Because, like, in the journal, you mentioned his powers. Right. So did nobody read it? <laughs> like, that's... See, that's... Okay, that's a bit of a, a jump. Like, especially cops should have read it. Or found it. I know I fucked Daniel over. Again. And now he's gone. Where That's we weird. Alright, so now we finished no, chapter one of ten. Out there. He might go back to Seattle. But too far. 
I I feel like I like I'm not talking much stuff because this is this is more of like if he tried to up with Claire and Steven. I don't want to just talk over everything like cuz this is this is definitely a story thing so like and 90 like seems like half the time the subtitles don't actually show up. So you can't even see it with me talking hear it without with me talking over so. What's that? Wait, what? Super wolf. Uh that mean? It means that Daniel... Is he writing in this thing? Daniel's with Jacob somewhere. He's safe. I could see Wait, him. Wait, what? Huh. What was it with Jacob? Who's Jacob? Jacob. Wasn't he one of the ones at the camp? I don't think so. Haven Point, Nevada. Yeah, Anders or Ingrid. Go, go back more. Oh wait, no, oh, I can. I gotta get to him. I can go past that. Button. I gotta find a way to escape. Tonight. Okay. Um, yeah, who is Jacob? Oh, wait, no, yeah, Jacob was like the shy guy. Yeah. Yeah, the other white dude. Yeah. Wait, but isn't he with Cassidy then? No, because Cassidy was only talking about Heather and Penny. So yeah, I guess... Jacob yeah, he was like... separate from the main group. Oh, I, th I thought they were together. Okay. No. Yeah. To clear off now. This whole hospital. They don't lock your room? What the hell is that? Okay. You want me to tell you how to do this properly? Find a way to get the hell out of here. Oh, okay. there's just many ways to do this. Let's see. Oh, I actually have to leave? Mm -hmm. Past that locked door. And an angry guard. So this one just get the the walkthrough gives just once and one possible way to do it. Do you want me to tell it to you, or do you want to just try and figure it out? Yep, it's just an empty socket now. Wait, is that what it showed? Mm-hmm. Oh, okay. This one isn't screwed in. I could pull it off. Hey, what do you say? I can pull it off, but... But... Oh. Okay. It's gonna be loud. So we try to pull it off, it's gonna be loud. Oh, that's to get out of the door? I wish I could just... walk out. No, I doubt it's to walk out. This backpack has gotta be somewhere around here. They've been working on these rooms forever. <sighs> so fucking last sweet dreams, my friend. So where's his bag? Nada. Okay, so if, if you... Uh, you just stick with the thing, figure out what you want to do. I like obviously have one thing to go. Maybe I could uh, climb out. Rig a decoy Sean in the bed. <sighs> Need a superhero to open that shit. Oh, because it's, it's uh, got a lock thing. You could mash and break it, but uh. Oh, it says inspect. Well, that's what I just did. Oh, oh. wait, first. Maybe. Can I have some privacy, please? Well, then you can't get to the bathroom, I think, right? Oh, you can. Huh. Is there something over here? Uh, yeah, it seems like. There's that bar. Uh, it's like that one's screwed in, so it's the other one. The, the, only, the, the only, only one you can interact with is the other one. Okay. Um, what can I do over here? Hope my last view of this world is in this window. One stupid car. 
So, I mean, you know. He's dead tonight. Works for me. So, we had, we, I mean, even with the simple tools, you have one idea that's, well, well it's concealing. Is that solid enough to hold his weight? Yeah, no, it's a, it's a desk. Like, that's... No, I'm talking about the up there. No, I mean, he has no way to get up there. Too bad this isn't a movie. Oh, I can't even fit. So, obviously, easiest easiest suggestion, you know. Tie the bed sheet and go out the window. Yeah. <laughs> that's super easy, super obvious suggestion is that. Like, how do I actually initiate that? Um, do you want me to tell you? I mean, look at look. For, I mean, look at everything first. Let's let's look at everything. Have I missed looking at something that's obvious? You didn't. I, you didn't touch the call button. You haven't looked at the bed. You haven't. Oh wait. What? That looks so fake. Okay. But it might work for a second. Yeah, I don't want to. Joey could probably distract the guard dog. Okay. Man, I'm supposed to enlist Joey, so? No, no, no. I never said that. I just said look at everything. So you have all your options. And then... Yeah. Thanks for the card, agent. And then it's up to you if you want me to. to text you. Do you want me to tell you how to start this? Yeah, just, yeah. I mean, simple, easy thing is you're going to need to break off the bar. Oh, but that's going to wake him up. So, do you want me to tell you the whole situation before we do this? Well, let's do it. Okay. Uh, so, okay, so then. Okay, go to the window. Get to the window. Nice job, Sean. Now the guard is awake and pissed off. Now what? Look at the scaffolding on your right, yeah. I could slip into one of those rooms under construction. Okay. Okay, exit the scene, then you'll have the option to break safely. Break the safety, I mean. Hmm. So that way you can actually open the window. Are multiple ways out of here? I don't know. It, it's it says that there are, and it just says one method below. So probably the thing where it said like Joey could distract the dog probably could have been another way to actually go outside. Yes. So get out the get out there. This is crazy, dude. And then just go towards the right. Freak out. Just get it. Gotta make sure it's evil. Even. Do you think it's really going to be that? Don't, I doubt, don't nod. Never they, they would do something like this. Keep going. But th because of this, you you, ha you don't have your backpack. Oh. Okay. I don't know the other way. So I, I'm sure there were other ways that you could have done, but like, yeah, I don't know the other way. Don't think. So all that money. But I doubt the money would have stayed there. Keep going. You know? Yeah, they would have confiscating it. Probably. Confiscated it. Holy nope. shit. No, depth perception. <laughs> Take a breath, dude. Just freak out, because he had no depth perception. Alright, we're good, we're good. We're making our way. Downtown. <laughs> <laughs> and there we go. I don't get why they make it act like it's such a big deal because like nothing's freaking way too close. Like you can't die here. Just because there isn't an actual fail state doesn't mean that there isn't like oh, okay. now you get Jeopardy shit. in universe. Okay. 
Wait, wait, he fell back to sleep after you made all that noise. Chance, dude. And all that just to go around. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> I, w I wasn't sur I'm surprised that he didn't wake up just from that. Like, I would have thought he would have. Change your clothes and everything. Yep. <laughs> no, I got the bag. Yeah, they got everything, but I'm surprised. Take the eye cleaner. I mean, if anything, maybe I don't have the notebook. No, you already had it. Mm. Oh, actually, yeah, because you didn't grab it when you left. I don't know. I'm surprised. Like, I would have thought they would have handcuffed you to the chair. Hmm. But then I guess you wouldn't be able to go to the bathroom and everything, and I guess the fact that you're a minor. That's, that's been... No way. Wait, he's given a room like, right next to the scaffolding? <laughs> well, he's not wanted for murder, so... You want to wake him up? Finn. Finn. Hey, over here. Holy fucking shit. No way. <clears throat> what the hell are you doing here? I'm trying to bail. Son of a bitch. <laughs> I wish I knew you were here. You're hooked up. Shit. So, where's Daniel? I can't tell. Oh, wait, I d you. she told me? No, he remembered because he saw the journal oh. and said, to me anymore. My fault you're in here. So, like, are you okay after you took all the sit? <laughs> How are you doing? Well, you know, <laughs> kind of sucks. <laughs> no coconut. <laughs> Damn. So, how bad is it? My eye's gone. <laughs> Coast. I'd say you still got one left. Charm. I know this doesn't But I'm sorry. <laughs> but I am sorry. About everything. Fun. <laughs> uh then it's way too late for that. Too easy. Oh. Sorry, no. friend, you lost your eye and your little brother. Whatever. It's over. I don't need any sorry. <sighs> that hurts. After everything, I do care. <laughs> yeah. He's still sorry. Still sorry. Yeah. He went for the angry. <laughs> I mean, there were two angry options. <laughs> no. It was angry, forgiving, and neither. It would have just been it, the the middle one would have just been like, mm, yeah, no, <laughs> or like you're not there, man. <laughs> well, no shit, they're not gonna be open. This is America, and this is not the '60s anymore. They don't leave their doors unlocked. He's gonna find one unlocked just to spite me. <laughs> That's what's gonna happen. Hey, he's gonna break it. Or I'm gonna break it. Oh my god, damn <laughs> Oh, fuck. Yeah, that's right. Fuck you. <laughs> that's not how I'm hurt. <laughs> Who the hell leaves their car unlocked like that? I mean, when it's a shit box like this. Still. Like in 2017, that's a shit box. No, in 2017, that's somebody who that's somebody who doesn't have money, so they did whatever they, they take whatever they need. Yeah, that's a shit box. Yeah, but you had a deal. You would still lock the door, especially if you have just a shit box, because you don't want to lose it and have no box. Sacred hope. Was that from? No, they're they're in California. They're not in freaking Oregon. It can't be, uh, Arcadia Bay. Mm. 
Wow, really? What? Nice. <laughs> That's a whole chapter. I don't know why they separated this into a chapter. Let's hear these sick beats. Yeah, okay, yeah, that makes sense. So let's, let's, if you don't understand, there's probably a song that would be playing right now. We've muted the licensed music so that this thing doesn't get copyright stricken on Twitch or YouTube when this gets put on. Uh, so it's, that's why it's just so quiet. <laughs> Definitely makes it awkward and weird, especially when there's parts where just like person's playing a guitar and obviously you're supposed to be listening to it and you just get nothing. <laughs> It's gotta be hard driving without for he, you know he he couldn't see he couldn't freaking put a pen, but now he's driving perfectly fine. Well, because there's no other cars on the road. And still, <laughs> he's also tired as hell, dude. <laughs> you don't even have two eyes. You can't look away from the road. Wonder if that license plate's gonna come back in some way. What, well, I didn't pay attention to what it was. JML, I think. Eight forty-three JML. Okay, well, I got the three letters right. He's just pretending that Daniel should be there or something. So are they going to Las Vegas now? Because I, I kind of figured with the way the billboards were in the preview that it was going to be heading towards Las Vegas, but I don't know. Hey, look, one, two, three, four views. <laughs> And title card drop. <laughs> and there we go, we've not finished 20% of this chapter, apparently. 20% of this episode is now done. It's not bad for 50 minutes, is it? Has it really been that long? Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god, yeah. Well, this is supposed to be the longest chapter, so let's see. We're hoping, we're hoping to finish, uh, hoping this goes as long as the last one did, so that it only goes to like 12.15, 12.30, because Bowen wants to record his podcast later, so <laughs> that way he doesn't have to wait me up to like 5 a.m. <laughs> I mean, it's fine. It's not like there are things. Which one are you doing now? Uh, Avengers. Oh, okay. First Avengers movie. Yeah, casino. Yes, they're, I think they're heading to Las Vegas. Or actually, well, that was the opposite way. Yeah. So they're, they're maybe sending away from Las Vegas. It just feels weird, you know. Like if you don't go, if you're setting it in Nevada, you don't go to Las Vegas <laughs> or Grand Canyon. But wait, no, Grand Canyon's not Nevada, is it? Or is it, is it Arizona? Somewhere in that. I can look it up. Why am I asking you? <laughs> yeah, you're the one with the computer. Arizona. That is not what I wanted. Not? What? No. <laughs> yes, it's in Arizona. Yeah, very far into Arizona. <laughs> he went pretty far too. Like if he was in North Cal California, he's heading to like he's by Las Vegas at least. Well, I, nothing. He, he might not be by Las Vegas. He's just by a casino. That's all we knew. I mean, for once, he actually has its own car. So. Mm -hmm. Well, you can check out the owner's stuff. Fuck. She's hmm. I guess I fucked up with you pretty bad. Oh god. <laughs> so you stole a nurse's car. <laughs> Good job, Bo. <laughs> okay. Haven Point is straight. Haven Point. Just, just a few more hours drive. Uh, let's see how much money we got. Seventeen nineteen. Yeah, cops took the cash, yeah. Yeah, that is definitely true. Nights in the desert are always cold. 
Wait, oh, so you're still you're at the very top of Nevada. Yeah. I think. No, we're here. Oh, Nevada top, but still, because the top of Nevada is up here. So you see, oh. look, you see on the map. Okay, so we're not even at the thing yet. Yeah, Las Vegas is all the way down there. No, so you, okay, so you didn't go that far south. You actually just went more east. Oh, come on. <laughs> she. Oh, <laughs> she had one too. Oh wait, wait. Um, pick it up. Yeah. <laughs> Some kind of lucky I stole a smoker's car. Okay, I think uh, you have to. Shit. <laughs> I will never hold on to it. You're out of gas. Uh, so you gotta clean your eye. Oh. Oh, yeah, it's just a button press. <laughs> yeah, no, it's, it's not like you have to actually be like, <laughs> like the death, death, uh, what was it, death, um, right. dead rising, <laughs> no, uh, dead, uh, dead space, dead space, dead space, too, where you're yeah. like, <laughs> 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 but you're cleaning up the eye socket, I guess, Yeah. of like bacteria, Yeah. and they're always just keeping it away so they don't see it. <laughs> But you saw it in, in the mirror? For like a little bit, yeah, from the bottom. I don't even know how long I should keep on using this for. Uh, I guess just look at the light. <sighs> what a mess. <laughs> Plotus can now act Grand Theft Auto. Yeah, no Grand shit, because he's still a car. Yeah, that. Just sleep in the middle of nowhere. Well, I mean, a lot of people do that. I assume truckers do that when they can't. <laughs> I mean, there's a lot of truck stops for that reason. But I doubt he's at one of those. No, but I mean, he's in the middle of the desert. But is that, is that what truck stops are for? You just sleep in your truck? Or yeah. is that, are they... That's why they also have, like, showers and stuff there. Mm. I mean, ice cream sundae pop tart. <laughs> pop tarts. It's not as cold as I thought it would be, but it's been in the fridge for like three days. It's not cold, yeah, but like it's been out for how long? Still. Still with me, Sean. Hey, you first one watching. Just zoning out. Just don't do that when you're driving, my son. So, uh. What's the verdict on the new car? I know it's not a new Ford, but it's got Ford Hot Wheels. Thanks for finishing it, Dad. A perfect <laughs> reward for your excellent report. Oh, so you got a new car. Oh, is that how he was planning on going to the party? You don't even bullshit me when you need cash. And I'll try to be cool. What do you say? Dad joke, huh? I hope you're not too bummed out to go on a big <laughs> trip with your lovely papita, huh? <laughs> oh, please. <laughs> the coolest dad. Lay it on. <laughs> How could I be bummed? You gave me drug money. <laughs> Where's my regular emotional <laughs> son? <laughs> I appreciate it. Think we can hang out for five days without killing each other? How yeah, no, I'm not the one that's gonna kill you. <laughs> since I was a kid. <laughs> God <laughs> damn it. So do I. Been too long since we went poverty against the road. We're drinking shit. Way too long. Oh, we got the. <laughs> what? No, oh, I thought you were drinking. No, we no I was just here. drinking because I'm drinking. No, you can. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Maybe I should do an actual drinking stream one time. <laughs> like playing a game while drunk. Or like becoming drunk. I don't know. You know. Oh, well, it's going okay. <laughs> okay. Yes. We, we could do a Mario Kart stream so we could drink and drive. <laughs> well, 
No, no, no. I mean, well, yeah, but like, yeah. and it'll be safe. We'll use the smart steering. No, just, <laughs> oh, uh, I, oh, God, I think he was talking about Layla. Uh, just, I don't know. Maybe just, mom. I don't get to see her. Oh. Kind of miss her. Oh, <laughs> you are both my son. Don't worry. This is how. Okay, I don't know who they were talking about, so we. <laughs> <laughs> Could that be Daniel? Hola. Hello. Everything okay, Lila? Oh, no, Daniel Lila's watching Daniel. Really <laughs> yeah, for you. Because <laughs> he's got a crush on you. <laughs> <laughs> he's real slow and safe. <laughs> Thanks for checking in. We'll buzz you when we hit the motel. Lila, Randy sounds good. And Sean? Be gentle. <laughs> <laughs> Jim says hi. Sounds pretty good, Sean. You think? <laughs> it's not the formal hello. No, it's, it's hi. <laughs> That's like the same thing when you say yay. It's like, okay, how many whys? <laughs> Well, sometimes I just miss our home, our family. Now I feel like I'm going in reverse. I went is he, the same so is this actually a flashback, or is this just him in his I head? I don't know. Family. I have total faith in you, Sean. You're a Diaz. You were born to roam and find your way home. God, I love you, Dad. Yeah, no, I'm feeling this is not. Uh, yeah, sure. no, I, this is this is. You didn't have to tell me. You yeah, this this is definitely not a flashback. By the way, hey, wake up! Huh? huh? What? Yeah, what the fuck are you doing on our property? Huh? Oh, man, I crashed hard. Oh, yeah? Come on out, boy. Who the fuck is that? A fucking kid. Get out. Okay, okay. I'm coming. Hold on. Good. Now we can see you. So tell us what the fuck you're doing on our land. I just... I just got lost, man. I wasn't sure where I was, so I pulled over. I swear, I had no idea this was your property. There's a fucking sign. Didn't you see it? See my eye? <laughs> I was too exhausted. I guess I missed it. He's just a kid, and he's hurt. Look. Yeah? What happened to your eye? I got into an accident. Oh yeah? Uh-huh. Move it. Huh. Please. I just want to go. Oh, oh. What's this? Drugs? Yeah, for my eyes. Oh yeah. Did you steal them? Like this car? Oh hey! Tony, thanks for the uh, thanks for the oh, bit, man. Bad. Damn. Dude, was it time? On. I guess it was. Get it. Let's see what he's holding. Oh jeez. Thank you so much for the the bit. Means <laughs> means a lot. <laughs> so, nothing good. Any money? Fucking toys, man. You still play with toys? Seriously? It belongs to my brother. <laughs> Leave it alone. I mean, I don't know how much of oh, you're taking it back. Yeah. Whoa, you did not. That's it, boy. Get up. What did he even step up? It's a puff of dirt. Okay, Chad. We fucked with him. Let him go. He's got nothing. Hey. Hold on a sec, Mike. You speak Spanish, Pedro? Huh? What? 
What? what? Hablas Espanol. Chad. So, Professor, how do you say, I'm a dirty thief? Don't do this. Oh, you don't want to share your language? <laughs> <laughs> okay, what is he going to do? Like, Maybe you know this one. Uh... I'm a dirty thief with one eye. <laughs> <laughs> it, are you? Soy un ladrón y chinga tu madre. Uh, wait, madre? Uh, yeah. No shit, man. Huh? All I want to do is learn Espanol. Might be our official language someday, right? See, si, senor. So, one more lesson. How do you say this is not? My country. Huh? Look, Chad, it's gonna. Oh wow, well, well, you it's took too, too long. Yeah. So, Jeez, yeah, these on. whole things are. This little thief is fucking with me. You're really pissing me off. You know that? But I'm willing to give you one last chance to make things right. And do what? I mean, like, sing something. What? Just pass the audition. You're free. You'll be very upset if you refuse. Fine. Yeah, just do it. Just you're not. Won't hear shit. Yeah, we're not gonna hear anything. He's gonna just sing. He's singing a song. Oh no. Okay, he is. We actually are hearing it. He just can't. Uh, I guess because there's no music. Well, no, it's supposed to be awkward because <laughs> this is no. I get it. A, a moment with accompaniment. I, I get that. The, the point I'm saying. Okay. Go on. Go on. This is yeah. This is really freaking. Oh god. Uncomfortable. This is uncomfortable. <laughs> oh boy. So is this all chapter four? Yeah, this is all chapter four. Then it's gonna then it's gonna end. How many are there? In ten. Okay. ten. There's ten chapters. Yeah, he's crying as all hell. Well, damn. I think you just won Mexican Idol. <laughs> now pick up all your shit and get the fuck out. Don't ever come back. Understand? Is he gonna get the saline as well? I don't know. Guess not. I think he did. I mean, he, they just threw it on the floor, I think. No, they threw it across. It was on the ground still. Oh, okay. I think. I don't know. God, like, you know, they say, like, this is my property. There's nothing fucking there. <laughs> like, I... Yeah, these are just people looking to hassle you. And he's out of gas. Alright. So the whole thing is, like, how much you're gonna take, right? So this this kind of stuff is like how much are you willing to accept and let them walk over in? Like you were in a, like if you look at it from outside, like you were kind of in a situation where you don't wanna deal with anything. I don't know. It's I we've been lucky enough to not have to deal with that. Me and Bowen. Uh we're Indian, not Mexican. And we are brown, so <laughs> but luckily we've not had to deal with any Overt racism of any, any kind, really. But nothing right. stop the wolf from following Have you? I, th I think not. Maybe there's something I'm repressing. Who knows? <laughs> or, I got it, Bone. Not that it wouldn't happen, I'm just saying, like, the area we live in, and at least. Mm, I can say my experience is nothing. Unless it was your kids in your class or anything, because none of the none of the adults you dealt with should have been that way, as far as I know. Yeah. 
I mean, I've experienced some of the, like, they didn't know they were being racist kind of racism. Hmm. Like, in high school, I, I so, uh, I, we had majors in my high school, and uh, I was doing uh, drama, and I was acting. And I had one teacher who was like, you know, you missed the bubble for the Indian actors. It's like, there's like, they're all over the place right now, but it's going to burst as soon as you actually can, you know, start booking roles. <laughs> no, okay. I don't, I don't think that's racist, because that's just, that's actually like, real experience. And like, Still a few hours away from mm. Cause that's just the racist world. Hollywood is is racist and like they right they're still yes they're opening up but honestly still ninety for major roles ninety percent are still white people yeah yeah but like to say that like three people who are brown that exist publicly is the bubble <laughs> might be some shade at the next building it's like oh it's oversaturated. <laughs> Yeah, under the billboard. Come on, let's see what we got. Yes. Yeah, get in the shade. Oh man. My feet are killing me. Ah. It's like hiking in hell. Never drew a desert before. You don't want to drink water? I'll do that afterwards. It's so empty and quiet. Unless there's something that's going to force me to get up. I don't think there's something that's going to force you to get up. I think you're fine. Got a good picture of it. I'm ready to be. I wish drawing was easy as just rotating the thumbstick. <laughs> She's like, rotate thumbstick. And now I must have peace. <laughs> Where was it? I Stop. saw it. No, no, like, there. Okay. Oh, it's oh, more dotted okay. lines. Okay. Yeah, because you did the bottom, now you gotta do the top. Draw now. Don't think about anything else. Come on, just draw clouds. This place is <laughs> Jeez, he's so glistening. <laughs> At least I won't mess up perspective for once. I guess that's an okay story. Yeah, you can always choose to stop. But I can keep going. Got a good picture of it. Alright. I'm ready and to now go. once again look up at the sky. And get the clouds. Get those fluffy clouds in there. Get the fluff clouds. Fluff clouds! Okay. <laughs> done. Put those sheep in the sky. It's a masterpiece. I guess I could spice things up a bit. Make Has this always fun. been an option for like all the drawings, or is this? New? I think it's new. I don't because I, I mean, granted, we only finished one. I could try adding details. What'd you pick, an oasis or hell? Hell. 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 Not a good picture. Huh. My eye always starts hurting when I focus for too long. I guess when you're trying to sh you're trying to look, you're straining. I guess. Yeah. All right, get some water. To get the full depth. See if you can have water. Shit. Probably out. My throat feels like sand. Oh, you got a bit. Twenty-two miles ahead. That's the thing about Nevada, it's like 90% desert. So it's like, god yeah. damn it. You had to walk, you're kind of screwed. Alright, now you got, there's nothing else, just get up. Jeez, where are you going? Okay, so, um. Okay, so you'll see something on the road as you're walking. If you want the collectible, pay attention to what, to where, what if you see something run across the road or something. Okay. Mm -hmm. Feels like I haven't seen him in years. Oh, wait, that thing. Of course, I miss everything about him. Even his whining. Was that? Okay, go follow it. Huh. No, no, follow oh. it. At least I got company. To the rocks. A skull. 
tiny my dick face. Tiny ass lizard skull. <laughs> oh no, it's Rango! <laughs> Alright, yeah. Now just keep going. That's the that's the only one for this chapter. Okay, so let me just keep walking. Cool, cool. I assume I'm gonna walk to the next sign. Uh, maybe. I'm not gonna say. <laughs> you might better get back to the towards the road. Yeah, get back towards the road. Oh uh, no. Yeah. You stick to the road. Shit, there's a truck coming. Whoa. Is he honking at me? He's stopping. Hooray. Okay, uh, be cool. Just see what he wants. It's the guys from earlier. <laughs> Shit, that would suck. <laughs> They come to hassle you more. Truckers can't be cops. Uh. <laughs> it sounds like a reality show that would be on one of those. Trucker cops. <laughs> yeah. hey. hey, need a lift? It's too damn hot to be walking. It's your choice. Wait, what? He's at, he's offering a lift. But like, what, why is this a choice? Because you can choose. Uh, you know what? Yeah. Let's see how wrong this goes. Yeah. Thanks. Hold up. Yes. Trust random stranger. <laughs> the unwritten rule of the road. <laughs> <He's gonna pull laughs> <a job. laughs> <laughs> Thank you so much, man. <laughs> Just randomly, randomly pick up. Like, I mean, people do that. Like, yeah. I, I'm an idiot who stepped into a car. <laughs> like, it's, I did that on my way back from high school one time. <laughs> there was an Indian family that literally, while I was walking at one and nine, uh, there was an Indian pair. That like just, it was like winter, and they were like, "Hey, let me give you a ride." And they dropped me off at fifty first. I don't know why I said yes because it was literally just from sixty ninth to fifty first. <laughs> And I'd walk that much normally, but I've done it, yeah. Jeez. What the hell happened to you? I ran into a couple of assholes. They beat me up for no reason. Uh, I see. It happens a lot around here. You want to refill both of our stuff? Or? Yeah, I mean, this is not going to be much. Uh, it's just a conversation. Yeah, I'll be right back. Hell yeah, he's got yeah, to see the radio. You want water? Ice? Just water. I, uh, I had to make a shit stop. Over. <laughs> you mean number uh. two? You owe me a beer for that. Over and out. Alright. Don't freak out. I, I wouldn't have picked you up if I cared about that hitchhiking law. Okay. Cool. So, you hungry wow, or what? this guy's being really nice. Was hungry. Hopefully, it's not waste. I am. Thank you. As you heard, my name's Anton. It is good, huh? My wife packs the best sandwiches. <laughs> Messy. Best sandwich ever. Seriously. Thanks, sir. Anton. Anton. Right. They do say food tastes better once you're completely drained. So what was he? Was he nice? He gave me a sandwich. Oh, good. Here's your cup. What's your destination? Thank you. Mm. Haven Point. <laughs> Heard of it? Oh yeah. Straight ahead. An hour. An hour? By driving? Jeez, you would have to walk quite a bit. Yeah, has he talked about life on the road or anything? <laughs> Not yet. 
Uh, I'm, sorry, I'm sure they're just vibing out to some music right now that we can't listen to. I love how just like the just some of these trip moments get lost. Take a nap if you want. You don't have to stay awake to be nice. Thank you. Hey, don't worry, kid. I'm not a weirdo. <laughs> Oh, that's helpful. Boring <laughs> trucker. Yeah, he's fading out. I think it's take an hour long nap. Yeah, it's nice. <laughs> yeah, I mean trucking like I don't know. I mean, that's I think the C B you'd had to be just keep yourself sane. Maybe it's a little different now because, like, I don't know. Like, I had problems driving for an extended period of time, like, by myself. Um, though, granted, luckily, uh, I, I guess I use I basically use podcasts and music and like music by myself to make it. But it gets uh, like it gets tedious after a while, like especially. The, the thing that, uh, honestly, the most dangerous thing for me driving is, uh... Really? Okay. Oh, great. We're in racist town. <laughs> okay. But the thing I said, like... like So that's what dr this entire episode's gonna be, isn't it? Maybe. Yeah. Straight, straight roads with no changes or anything, and especially if no cars are coming, that actually is the thing that throws me off the most. Because... You just start, um, it all blurs together. Yeah. If there's no change, things just start blurring together. Bet on the Lord. <laughs> Take Pascal's wager. <laughs> Other religions, what are those? <laughs> Okay now? Is it gone? <laughs> oh god, is this one of those pray away the sickness things? <laughs> Scoot back inside now. Okay. Uh, hello there. Is everything alright? Yeah, yeah. Don't worry. You here for the service? Not really looking for some. Don't be shy. Everybody's welcome here. No matter who you are or where you are. Did this say what you are in the hood? <laughs> we are all equal. Plus, we have a pretty nice spread after the service. Stay as long as you want. Okay. Uh, Let's visit the Lord. <laughs> Thank me. I'm just a vessel for our Reverend. Thank her. <laughs> Looks like you're here to see our new miracle, right? Uh, what miracle? <laughs> you haven't heard of him? Oh. Uh, spoil it. Okay, I think they are talking about Daniel. He'll be here any minute now. Just come inside and see for yourself. <sighs> Praise he, he really just <laughs> doing tricks for Jesus? <laughs> Go inside. That poor little girl. <laughs> Cop. Yeah. <laughs> that poor little girl. Okay. Uh, look, look to the table on your right. Uh, look, look at that table. There was something over there. Oh, I <laughs> feel that cold air. Oh, thank God for AC. A picnic with Daniel. Yeah. What's going on? Look at that. Oh, a, so, oh, maybe it was a table right to your right. Nice picture. Wonder if they'll let me in. Oh no, the pin, the pin book, the pin. That was what it was. I was right. Praise be to Daniel. <laughs> uh, yep, he's doing tricks for Jesus, people. <laughs> Take the pin. That's the souvenir. Hmm. For charity. 
Alright, um... I don't think you want to donate. I wonder how donations can pay for all of this. Nah. It can seduce you and destroy your faith. I know you understand. So we're halfway through? This is chapter of six. Oh, I guess, no, not there. Check upstairs then? Oh, shit. I will draw too much attention. Better try upstairs. Oh. <laughs> too late now. <laughs> what? You could have washed your face in the bathroom. <laughs> Were my brothers and sisters. Oh no. What is faith? Okay, Remember so that's the, the preacher. What is impossible for man is Wait. possible for God. With that righteous. You think that's their mother? Comes the salvation Maybe, yeah. of your soul. Can you cross that impossible bridge to salvation? Do you want your soul I don't know. But that's that's definitely she's Robert definitely the reverend. So is Daniel gonna be touted out oh, soon? Probably. You are not tricked like out. out <laughs> not tricked out, but like trotted out as a show pony. So I yeah. Trotted out for a trick. <laughs> that's not <laughs> spoke to me and told me that I God, she's one of those types. And to reward our great faith, the Lord sent me the ultimate gift. An angel, a child graced. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And, you know, it's very different from the first game where basically only one person knew of anything going on. Can I get a hallelujah? First game is just Chloe, and you don't say shit to anybody else. And then here it's just like basically anybody you spend enough time with learns. The only one who I think the only one who didn't was Brody. <laughs> Welcome our newest member and our latest miracle, the angel. Damn, these definitely sound like uh, the type of church that would be funding those Christian movies. <laughs> You know, like the God is dead. Pure Flix. That's the name. The Pure Flix movies, yeah. But God saved Daniel so he could do his work. I assume she's he's staying with the uh, with the preacher. To me, to deliver us, to guide us from the wilderness to our destiny. Now Daniel will reveal the true power of the Lord. Raise, up. raise Jesus. He's gonna raise Jesus. Yeah, that's probably what's gonna happen. He's gonna raise the cross. Bless up. <laughs> yep. Levitate the cross. And now drop it and kill them all, <laughs> dude, dude. Yes, make it like, make it like a Metalocalypse episode. <laughs> just, <laughs> just start spinning. <laughs> just, just, it just, it just becomes a blender. <laughs> just, kill it. just everybody in. Uh, it's not gonna happen. Uh, we respect people of faith. <laughs> yeah, we're, not, we're not saying that it would be fun because they're... It would just be a funny thing to happen in general. Not because of anything in particular about these people. So it's saying Daniel's a prophet? Well, I mean, yeah, that, that's what they've been saying. <laughs> no, I thought they were just saying that he's a tool. A 
I didn't think they would think that he is actually a messenger from God. I mean, in a sense, all the messengers were vessels of God, so they were tools. That's not what I meant. <laughs> Forget it. It's not important. I, maybe I'm not saying my words correctly. He's not looking good. Or at least, maybe it's just the, the thing he has to be, just quiet, sullen. Because <laughs> he just looks pretty sullen. As our reverend said, we do appreciate your kind donations. It helps us keep our church and to spread the word of God. Oh yeah. So how are we going to get, how are we going to spring Daniel out of here? I mean, you know, I know that's probably what he's thinking, but the fact is, if Daniel doesn't want to leave with you, he's not going to let you. So you first have to talk to him and just convince him to let you go. Let you come, let, that he wants to nah, go. knock him out first. Yeah, that's <laughs> not a good idea with the walking WMD, or really walking tornado maker. <laughs> He's on WMD, that's over exaggeration. <laughs> He's an IED. <laughs> Oh, oh. Uh, hi. <laughs> hi. I saw you out in that parking lot earlier. Yep, that was me. I had a seizure too. We can see the whole room, and it's where a reverend mother teaches his classes. Oh, good. You okay? Oh. I'm perfectly fine. Not you. <laughs> yeah, I know. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no, I have Sorry. dreaded light coughing disease. It's terminal. <laughs> She's dead. She's dead. That's According to any TV show and movie rules, she is dead. She has the light cough. She's fucking gone. <laughs> that's how the that's how anything that's not real life works. <laughs> what happened to your eye? Well, that's a long story. That's okay. <laughs> Got time? <laughs> I only have a little bit left, but I'm willing to hear your story. Uh -huh. so you must be Jacob's sister. Did you get that letter from Jacob back when he was in California? Yes. Oh. <laughs> How did you know he was in California? Oh, it's... I was with him. That's how we met. You are Daniel's brother? Really? He's always huh. talking about you. Hey, uh, not too loud. Yes, I'm Daniel's brother, but I need some help. The Reverend Mother says we always have to help our neighbor. What do you need? Uh... Who is this Reverend? You don't know her? That's her mother, Lisbeth. She was blessed by the. What was their mom's God name? Mike. Karen. <laughs> she can't ever sin. The Lord guides her. name is Karen. Yeah, I know. That's what. That's literally <laughs> what we said. That's what I said when. This is our home, <laughs> our church and community. The Reverend Mother says we are all. Why doesn't she just call her mother? You gotta. What you is got. She worked for that reverend, all right? You gotta honor the honorific. And the Lord brought him right to our reverend mother. I like him. He's really kind and funny. We play together all the time. She worked hard to find a child to exploit. So, can you take me to Daniel? Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Like, yeah, Daniel, like, that was not a, the way to... Uh, that was not a good way to say it first. Fucking... Like that line read... So this is chapter six. Mm -hmm. so, yeah, lots of donations after that. <laughs> You're the living proof of their faith and mine. I know you understand. I guess. I mean, Sean. Oh my. Sean, you came back. I knew it. You've grown up in Anna. Do I look older? What? What happened to your eye? Don't worry. It's okay. Did that happen at the farm? Because of... Relax, relax. Him? He's not gonna blame so you. Sorry. Especially after we just found you. <laughs> I'm sorry. Forget it. It wasn't your fault. I should have... It's okay. It's interesting that now we keep getting the big wolf instead of the little one. Yeah, I, I... not as much as the haircut. Shut up. It's different. I can't 
kind of like got that. the beaver bowl. Come on. I didn't want to leave you there. It's just a bowl cut. <laughs> it's called a bowl cut because what it's made by a parent just putting a colander or a bowl around your head and just cutting everything that's below it. <laughs> We're together now. Yes. So, are you gonna stay with us now? Huh? I. We still need to go to Puerto Novo. But we don't need to. We have a new home now. Look. One step at a time, Din. Give Sean a chance to process this. I'm sure this is all so overwhelming. By the way, my name is Lisbeth Fisher. We all prayed for your Sure. <laughs> yes, I would love to play the person who would take away our uh, our meal ticket. Sure. <laughs> mm. Oh. Daniel oh, hey, David. <laughs> yeah, we got our drinks. We're going. <laughs> but first, I need Sarah Lee and Patrick. Daniel. Are you streaming right now? We have I am stretched. <laughs> uh, I will stretch too. Like, uh, is he streaming right now? Let me just say hi. No, he's not. Daniel. Now. Oh, he's saying get out. Yeah, she's gonna be like, "Don't you fucking take away my meal ticket, bitch." <laughs> he's mine. It's a pleasure to meet you. This is a real blessing today. You were away from Daniel for quite a while. Yeah, it was totally my fault. Yeah. <laughs> uh, yeah, sure. <laughs> I was in a coma. <laughs> so what is your plan, Sean? This is a blessed family, and it would be good for Daniel to have you by his side. You should know that the Lord has been... <laughs> yeah, she, she's... She's, uh... Hmm. God or you? God, mm. yes, of course. I'm his family. Two young boys are not a family. Mm. Mark 3, 25. If a house is divided against itself, that house cannot stand. Daniel How is it divided? Guest. It saddens me that you see things that way. After everything I've done for him, I know why you're scared, Sean. That's because your heart's full of sin. <laughs> I've heard everything about your journey, Sean. And I let you take me. Yeah, he's she's kicking you out. Into my community. Not until you make penance. <laughs> that was a you, you yeah, saw that, right? <laughs> yeah, the I'm stuff like that's been happening. I'm not your son. And Daniel isn't gonna be your golden cow. Daniel, come on. Why don't we ask him what he wants to do? Do not oh. touch me. <gasps> not good. What the fuck? What did you do? Nothing. Enough. What the? You spilled blood. How the hell? Sean, oh. what happened? Your brother came in here in pure and acting like a criminal. But he can be saved, Daniel. I'm sorry, Sean. She's right. I will pray for you. Then, when you're ready, we can. She's trying to manipulate you. Let me lead you to the one true left that never goes out. I want to be your friend. You're crazy. Let's get out of here, Daniel. <laughs> I want to stay. Just go. There's your answer, Sean. We're together again. So we can go, right? Come on. Get okay, off. damn. Okay. What? Daniel! Let me go, asshole! Daniel! They're not your family! Stop it. You just need God, to like, me. this is really... <laughs> Daniel! It's okay, Sean. Daniel! It's a lot more heavy-handed than the earlier chapters. Yeah, this is a lot more episodes, I should say. Now don't you ever come back? Come on, kid. Don't make me do this. You're not gonna win. Just punch in the face, jeez. What happened to being all, we're here for everybody? Daniel! 
Daniel! Daniel! Well, that's the thing. The second you actually start to question them, I have a legal right to stop any intruders like you. I want my brother. I want my brother. But he doesn't want you. Yeah. He was brought here. This is where he stayed. Next time, I will not hesitate to use. I am a vessel of God. <laughs> Get out of here. Daniel, hey. And with his power in me, I will bring you to your maker. Oh my god. <laughs> what is he supposed to be, Father Anderson from freaking Helsing? Sean? Jacob? Oh, wait, no. Uh, oh, yep, it, can't, it is the way. You won't get him back like this. Let's go. Wait, was it Karen's letter in Haven Point, I guess? <laughs> It was when, the, yeah, it was when they were at the it said Haven grand, Point grandparents' house. I didn't think it said Haven Point. I thought it just said, uh, it just had a PO box. Yeah, that was like here. No, I thought the Haven Point was because of Jacob. That's why, just because this is Jacob's family. I didn't think I didn't. I I was being facetious when I said Karen would be here. I didn't actually think she would actually show up. Though I, great, I thought that was the mother. I wasn't sure. He said you were missing, and that Daniel needed help. Oh, okay. So Jacob, Jacob knows about his family being like fucked up, and like that's why he only cared about his sister. You know, Sean. Sooner or later, we're gonna have to talk. Where are we even going? I already have a hotel. Room. Yeah, I see. So she, see, she came here. She wasn't here normally. She came here via other means. Or because she knew of the other things. Alright. So we got four more bits to go. Uh, this should be fine. You want me to black it out just in case? I mean, it's not like they're gonna show a penis. Do you want me to black it out just in case? You know, I'm just gonna black it out just in case. <laughs> we'll, we'll go. Didn't show anything, but still, just 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 to be careful. I don't want to do it. So he's just showering. Still got the eye patch on. Yeah, they, I mean they they are only showing above the waist, and I'm sure he's gonna get a towel on or something. Jeez, see those bruises. I mean. He was beaten multiple times over the course of a couple days. Yeah, I mean, wasn't most of it on his face, though? I mean, there was a lot of being thrown to the ground. Yeah, but being thrown on the ground doesn't create that, those kind of words. I mean... And kicked on the ground yeah. and stuff. <laughs> Alright, that's good. God, it just looks so bad. This is, so, like, the freaking... Just the, the the fuzziness just grows so much there. Okay, here we go. This is a really big bathroom for a hotel room. Yeah, it really is. What is this room's design? God damn. Karen seems to be on the move quite often. She's got a, what, just for having a traveling kit? I mean, normal people have traveling kits too, you know? Oh, wow, they actually have reflections. <laughs> you look bad. Gotta change that dress. Yeah, unfortunately, I don't have the extra stuff because the guy stole my shit. <laughs> uh, hold on. I think there is. Uh, oh, yeah, it's it's outside. Yeah, it's in the drawer outside in the in the thing. Uh, the one between the beds. All right. Where did she go? It's probably getting food or something. Wonder how long Karen has been here. Just did she see? Okay. Oh, nothing in there. Uh, it said on. Maybe it's just on the in the Bible. I really 
we should finish eating this someday. No, yeah, it says um, in the drawer between the two beds. Maybe it was in that corner. Yeah, remember? He, no, that, he, he's blind. So you gotta look. That's it. And there you go. And then there's just a bunch of stuff you can interact with. There's a note. You've come a long, long way, buddy. Alright. Okay. Oh, she's got a keychain. Huh. Kinda pretty. What's the letter? Is that the letter from, uh... So Karen did check it out. Yeah, yeah, Wonder if she saw Daniel in action. Inspect her bag. We'll come back to that. That's, it's not what moves the thing forward. This country too damn big. <laughs> way too big. Honestly, it's not that big. <laughs> like, Canada's way bigger. <laughs> yeah, but there's also a lot of smaller countries. <laughs> Much smaller countries. Be right back. Popped out for supplies, I'll grab some. <laughs> Be right back. He's just like, well, oh, this is gonna be a went out for cigarettes moment. <laughs> Good time to contact Jacob. It's easy. Jeez. I need to keep her mom to do something to give a shit. Okay. This isn't her tablet. Struggles with too many apps open, open apps, but should be okay for basic browsing and geo geolocation. So annoying. It's got the camera blocked, you notice? Yeah. Okay. Hey, uh, technology. Rubber and mother doesn't look too humble. Yeah, that. <laughs> Looks like a roach monkey. Wait, wait. What, what was the middle one? Hey! Hard all line! Cool! Um. Yeah. It's just more. Eggs more stuff talking about Daniel. Oh, I'm sorry, we were so quiet. We weren't even reading it. <laughs> uh, let's see. You know what? Let's call. It's a uh, cell phone's over there. I wonder if you could also call uh, Layla. It's been so long. I even think it's the one. I mean, do we have her number saved? Oh, I didn't call from the uh, that phone, the hotel phone. She can't prepare. Ah. I mean, wouldn't you have to first like route out of the hotel? I mean, that buttons do that. I don't think you got to pay though. Jacob, it's me, Sean. Yeah, I was in a coma. Yeah. I know. I'm not far. In a motel. Wait, Daniel, how's he doing? Mm -hmm. So Jacob's back there too. Jacob, wait. Yeah, it was def definitely running into the whole uh, religious cult kind of thing going on. Okay, so what now? Wait for her to come back. He couldn't really talk. This is so messed up. I think the only thing you didn't expect inspect was Karen's things. This place is quite remote. Hmm. This place is quite remote and literally a car goes by right at that second. <laughs> yeah, let's look through her shit. <laughs> See if she's got another family. <laughs> I know I should <laughs> You saw that? Whatever. Damn. Okay, yeah. No, I don't know. read it. To capture the world around <laughs> Even she has got him. <clears throat> she learned the lesson. If she didn't want kids. Karen did her own road trip to get here. Mm -hmm. Is that eight dollars? Okay. 
Okay, three dollars for a grilled cheese. Ah, it's weird that that's, that's still cash. pretty cheap, man. Yeah. <laughs> Not even a two bucks for a soda. Bullshit, man. Everybody always pays you pay like two bucks for sodas nowadays. Two plus. I mean, that's on the East Coast. Yeah, I guess in the more remote locations, it might be cheaper. The only thing we have with the West Coast was that one truck stop where everything was 20 times the price because it was the only thing within 50 miles. You remember that? Yeah. That one in the freaking when we were on Route 1 going along the coast of uh, California, and it was just like literally the highway. Yeah. Like, it was, it was literally on the edge of the like mountain. The and, yeah. Yeah. How are you feeling? It was the only freaking road for, like, the, the only little, like, gas station and diner for, like, 50 miles. And we didn't get shit there. We filled up on gas. That was it. No onion. Right? That'll hmm. Double cheese, no onion. Remember that. <laughs> So, mom, we haven't seen in eight years. Got you some gauze and uh, antibacterial stuff for your eye. Hey, don't wolf that down. Let's <laughs> take a breath. What do you care? Sean, I do. <sighs> Come on, Karen. Damn, that, that burger is a brick. It's too late. Where were you when I broke my leg when I was 13? Not with me. When Daniel got a bad flu a couple of years ago, he didn't sleep next to him every night. <laughs> I had to do that. Where were you? Where were you? Fair enough. So let's talk, because we do have to get your brother out of a cult. Yep, nope, it's a cult. <laughs> Other people are calling it that too. How did you two survive alone on the road for that long? We just got lucky. And got some help along the way. Total strangers. We even had our own little family. Good. How did you go to Beaver Creek? You know I don't have to answer your questions, right? You're right. So tell me what you want from me, Sean. Nothing, Karen. I mean, what do you want from me? <laughs> a fucking hug? Hey, I just want you to know what I did and why, if you care. So, ask me anything. All right. Why'd you leave? <laughs> why did you bail on us? Yeah, that's got to be the number one. I wasn't. I wasn't meant to be. Oh, oh wow, really? I thought I was supposed to. I tried to pretend for many years. But after the second kid, I just couldn't do it. Wow, okay, free spirit. To leave just became unbearable. I had no other choice. Are you serious? You chose this life. You fell in love. You made your own choices, right? Making your own choices doesn't mean you can never fool yourself. Yeah. I... After I had Daniel, you were about eight, and Esteban's garage was getting busy. There was so much. Somehow I just felt out of place. <laughs> I mean, that is a thing where it's like you sacrifice everything for your children. Sean, it was the hardest decision I ever made. And then some people can't do that, and some people just want to live their own life. But I took that responsibility. Be a bit more selfish. I think he said that. Did Dad know about all of this? I was honest with your father. We did family therapy, but it wasn't about It was me. about me. Even my problems. He was so much better than you. He wouldn't talk about what you did. Like, when I asked why you left, he just said you had to go live your own life. He was right about that. <laughs> he was right about that. I need my own life without you in it. You're so fucking selfish. Yes, I am. Okay. Anyway. You can ask what are you doing here? Just get the full interrogation. Yeah, sure. So what exactly are you doing in Nevada? You live around here? No. I'm uh, way out. <laughs> yeah, it's not that far. Sean, I told you. Your friend uh, Jacob wrote my P.O. box and said Daniel was in trouble. 
That's it. Arizona? Holy shit. It's just lizards and rocks. <laughs> I found some. Nice I found rocks. something. I found <laughs> something that's not you. <laughs> really do me good. So. New York didn't do me good. I can't do good in yeah. Oregon. Okay. Or, no, Washington. I, heard I didn't have a choice, Sean. We only have one life. And I didn't want mine to be spent in. No regrets. For years. Oh jeez! Now we gotta save Daniel from a freaking cult. This is what uh, chapter six or seven. This is seven. But I never stop caring about you. For what it's worth. I mean, this seems to be going a lot quicker than we anticipated. Oh yeah, no, I think this is gonna end um, within an hour. I think we'll we'll be done with this in an hour. Yeah, once again, you went with the angry. No matter what, you left your own. Listen, I only have one eye left. <laughs> I'm not in a happy mood. I still don't care. It's time for big wolf mode. <laughs> big wolf mode. <laughs> I'm surprised no mention of the cops. Mm. Also, with the way Daniel's name has been putting out, the, I guess maybe because they're only using his first name, and there's tons of Daniels. I'm pretty sure they're just deliberately looking the other way. What, you, th you think the cops are just purposely not looking? No, I think that uh, the people at the cult know, but they're just... No, I'm saying the cop. why wouldn't the cops realize? This is the time. Like, is it just because Daniel's a common name? Did he say whatever? I guess, I mean, they have no reason to think that Daniel would be, like, superpowers or something. So, did you ever actually miss us? Or Dad? Of course, Sean. I do miss your father. He had such a big heart. Yeah, now it's splattered all over the ground! <laughs> He could brighten up the rain. <laughs> oh, jeez, I really gotta stop. <laughs> it's, it's bad. It's also too easy. I'm not good with coming up with <laughs> interesting stuff. That's why I'm not the comedian. You are. Well, <laughs> Remember you did that comedy stuff in high school? <laughs> yeah, I mean, like, five years ago? Yeah. <laughs> Which you never showed us. <laughs> Whatever will end the conversation. I can tell you that right now. What did you do when you left? Where did you go? Cotton Eye Joe. <laughs> that freaking Tumblr post thing. <laughs> I guess all this time I tried to find out what really matters to me. Which doesn't involve a husband and two kids. It does. Yeah, but not to me. <laughs> totally respect that. Yeah, that's literally what she said. <laughs> I don't give two fucks about you. <laughs> One, maybe. Job, marriage. That's my mom and dad. They wanted me to follow their rules, their faith. I tried, but I wanted. I guess maybe with how much she was talking about faith in the beginning with the grandparent, that they were trying to set up that faith might be an issue here. I'm just like I don't. I'm surprised. I thought they would go more with the racism stuff, but they're bringing in this faith issues as well. I'm going with a I'm going with a cultist thing. Was it worth it? <laughs> Hope it was worth it. Was. <laughs> I don't. I don't regret leaving you. With <laughs> like-minded people. I'm at peace. Jeez. How do you make peace with bailing on your parents, your kids, your husbands, and your kids? I know that's hard to understand. It's simple. You stop giving fucks, and then it doesn't matter what your responsibilities were, because you don't care. <laughs> I mean, I get you wanted to leave and stuff. Okay. But why would you ghost us like that? Not even a fucking birthday card. I just needed a clean break. 
I thought if I would be easier. <laughs> but I wanted to contact you guys. So yes, okay, if people vanish, the kids will definitely not ever care about their father, mother. It's like you're that. <laughs> you wanted a clean break. That's literally what I said. But you wanted a clean break. I didn't want to be a part-time pissed-off mother. Not fair to anyone. Part-time pissed-off mother. Don't. Still very young. So Why do you have to be pissed off? You're just not there. Cool plan, mom. You heard Daniel way worse. He thought you took because of him. Yeah. Because of it. I know. All right. Let me just get my cigar. And the next one is like a nothing chapter. I can start shaving his ass. Apparently, it's just a cutscene. More music that doesn't exist. No, I don't think it's, it's that. I think it's just a thing where you just you just don't talk. I mean, you you don't have much. You just it's just a conversation. Careless. It's like you can't even realize how much. Yeah. You talk. I do care. That's why I'm here to help you. To make up for all the shit that I didn't do. <laughs> Couldn't live. I wonder if you'd been less heated, would this conversation be happening inside, or...? Yeah, because that's what's uh, great best to do in the middle of the desert. If you're, if you're too hot, you go outside. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> Once again, did you press something or no? No, no too late. Okay. Hmm. He didn't want me to die early death, and he did that for me. <laughs> we didn't fight much, but when we did, I would go out on the porch and light up so I could stand down. Hmm. So that would have been weird if you had asked him, like, you remind me of your father. I'm like, oh god, no. I used to do the same with my best friend. Sitting on the porch. Blazing it. That's when you know someone is good to you. No, no, she was just my best friend. She wasn't the one I wanted to sleep with. I mean, <laughs> We should go back inside. Yeah, it would just been like. I got a chance. Yeah, it's just okay. being there. Let's go. Let's redress the eye. Oh boy. Sean, I know I can't change the past. Oh, what I, did. But this is about I know I you. can't change the past. <laughs> I know somebody who can. <laughs> Wait, what? Basically, this is this is about helping your brother. So let me help you. I know. That was what he said. It's still hard. But yes. I'll accept your help. <laughs> to be your team. To we can do it. Hmm. We need to get in touch with this Jacob. He obviously knows a lot more than us about the church. Well, I called him when you were out. We can meet with him tomorrow. Okay, good. I also got these, just in case. Walkie talkies? Or is that a recording? Okay. Better take care of the eye. So, do you need any help with that? I'm good. <laughs> oh, Sure. Sure. Yes. Thanks. So, you feel like telling me the story here? Are we actually gonna see it? When we have time. Gotcha. I mean, we got time now. <laughs> yeah, but then... Granted, saying something surprising while someone's sticking something in your eye socket is not exactly a good thing. So yeah, I guess I get the idea.
all these angles they do just to sh- to, just so that they didn't have to make a new model. <laughs> so they didn't have to make one without the eye. I mean, they did. did I, I didn't see it, so I don't know. Maybe it was Kalante. I mean, it probably was. I didn't, I was not paying attention at that very second. This kind of feels so fucking weird. <laughs> having, having, uh, having to open up your eyelids even though nothing's there. Here, try this one. <laughs> My patch. <laughs> Doesn't he still need the dressing though? Huh. Now we're going to escape from Cult Bay. <laughs> Snake Bliskin. <laughs> well, I guess the idea is that this is washable. Yeah. So he could just use this one. No, I, I get it, but it's not sterile. I mean, if they keep putting the thing on it, then it would be. No, the, they'd have to wash the, the thing like very thoroughly every yeah. day. Just putting the thing on is not enough. Okay, this is chapter 8. Okay. And it's all conversation. Great. Yeah, and then 9 and 10 is the... So 9 is the big one, and then 10 is a shorter thing. Well, it's basically just all whatever 9 is. We're just going to be the escape. Sure he's going to show up. He better. He promised. Jacob's not Finn. He's not he a... Doesn't f- find us. <laughs> We'll find him. Well, technically, Finn wasn't a flake either. He was just uh, impulsive. Hon- honestly, that was what he was. He, he yeah. just he learned about the new power. He wanted to get a get a little bit, and he was impulsive. He wasn't honestly. He that was his crime. He didn't think. Yeah. He just got a little too uh, hyped up. It's a really big hatchback. So tell me, <laughs> Daniel. What's he like? He's a little rascal. <laughs> he never stops. Just like you, Dave, you know? No, I don't know. <laughs> Is that got another car coming. Is that him? Oh my god, is that my whole oh, freaking Seriously? Oh, we're getting another one of these moments. Yeah, on stream. I'm fully <laughs> doing it. Oh wow, he cleaned up. Sean, what happened? Jake, I'm not mad, but you better explain everything. I didn't know where else to go. Listen, I I saw Daniel come back to the camp that night. Like he was in shock or something. Then I heard all these sirens and I got scared. I just, I packed a few things, I, I took a blanket from your tent, and we, we left together. I also kept the cash you made on the farm. Uh, it's in my car. You did right, Jake. Thank you. You have no idea what he looked like when I found him at night shop. He was in bad shape. Where's the with you? a gunshot wound, and all by himself. I, 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 I couldn't just leave him there. Yeah, it's right there. What about the others? Yeah, well, I don't just dash, just dash them. What happened to them? They ran over to Merrill's place when they found out Finn was gone. That was the last time I saw them. Then on our way out here, Daniel told me more about what happened that night. How scared he was. The blast. Daniel feels he's got to redeem himself for what he did. Until he goes to Jesus. Yeah. Jacob. He's not guilty of Yeah, I told him to do it. <laughs> should have him better. I'm telling you to be careful with the Reverend Mother. That's why they keep saying Reverend Mother. He doesn't, they don't really, or he doesn't really believe in, like, he keeps her separate. She's good at this. He yeah, she's, the emotional manipulation is a fucking thing. Has faith in the Reverend now. 
Yeah, not afraid of that Lisbeth of yours. I'm getting Daniel out of here. Oh, come on. There's no way they're going to let you take him away. Well, too bad. We're not going to ask for their permission. You must be Jacob. I'm Karen. Hi. Okay. I don't know if you want to do this, but I, I have an idea. Well, we don't get any others. <laughs> School must be over by now, but Lisbeth will stay in church with Daniel for his yeah. classes. That'll give us time to sneak into the compound before we get to them. It didn't seem like that huge of a place. I mean, yeah, but it's, it's the fact that it's all empty means you can't really sneak up. One more you know, there's nothing to hide behind. There's no trees to duck I, in. Uh, we have to get my sister, too. Sarah Lee. Really, Jacob? Come on, man. She's with your parents. I know. Please, listen, Sean. She's not safe here. She's sick. And they, they're just gonna pray everything away. Everything Elizabeth says. And yeah, she god damn stupid. I know you understand. With enough money sent to Joel Olstein, yeah. your child too can survive cancer. Okay, Jake. I'm listening. Elizabeth knows what's wrong with Sarah Lee. We just, we need to find her medical record. I think it's in her home office. Then I'll go get Sarah Lee while you get Daniel. Okay? Fine. Sure. I'm gonna trust you on this, Jacob. All good for you, Karen. What if Daniel won't go with you? He will. I know him. Uh, so I guess this is where you're, if you were pushing him and he was mad at you all those times. So this one, at least, it seemed like you had a close relationship, so it shouldn't be a problem. You should be able to get him out yeah. pretty easily. Okay, so now it's the freaking heist. <laughs> Steal the kids. <laughs> I mean, that's what you're doing. <laughs> well, it's more of a rescue situation than a heist. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> They're people, Belmont. They're not objects. <laughs> okay, so apparently, yeah, there's multiple ways you can do this. So there's the one that's given, and then there's multiple ways you can do it. I don't know. I'll see if I can figure out one. We got some time. Well, remember, this the game, the, the way this works, it, there's no rewind, so you can have a bad entrance. Yeah. So it's up to you if you want to just go through all the options and then... I mean, even with a bad entrance, it's not going to ruin the rest of the game. It's up to you. However you want to do it. Let's see what happens. Now it's where the fun begins. <clears throat> oh, this is the Universal Uprising. If anything happens... What? Let me do the the, that church that was mentioned yeah. at like the first chapter or something, we were like, that's a very menacing name. Oh, yeah! <laughs> it's right behind the church, so in and out. Okay. What, what was that? You sure was it on his blog? Those files on your sister? That was like a fly or something that I saw a lot earlier. Oh, at the gas station? Yeah. Wait, wait. You missed something. Okay, so there's somebody else in the place. God damn, we didn't see where. Oh. People aren't supposed to come and go around the church. Careful, careful. Better to avoid them if we can. There's a person. Karen. Everything all right? Oh. I think that's Karen. Oh no. Hello, no. young Hackerman. What are you doing here? Oh, uh, hi. We weren't done yet. Sorry, we're uh, we're in a rush. Oh. No. Sean, what are you doing? Do you want us to get caught? Sorry, I wasn't really thinking. Oh, we're supposed to go. Which building? I'm sorry, I didn't realize. Don't stop to talk, and she'll become suspicious, but won't question you further. Okay. So no, apparently no. you were no, you were right. Okay. You were fine. Because that's what they say to do. If you want to pause, I can tell you what it is, or... Let's hope so. There's a side door and enter the building. Side door. Closed door is a closed heart, she says. Take it, it's this one? Probably. 
can't believe Danny really lives in this depressing house. After talking to Jacob, you have free roam of the building. I, just, I hope they're not onto us. Let's haul ass. Where are the files? Right there, in her office. Oh, of course it's locked. Our open door speed is just another line. What? That's crazy. I find a way in. Fuck. I think there's a key somewhere. Maybe she's too cautious not to have a spare set around. Okay, this is bigger than I thought it was gonna be. <sighs> Whoa. Are you okay, Jake? Yeah. No. It's just it's a lot of chaos. Probably for the girl. Especially for someone who doesn't believe in science. Okay, um... Don't... Did she teach Daniel how to play this? So apparently there's a... on, on the bed. A tiny bed. Not that bed. Is the collectible. But, uh... Okay. What the? She's completely. Yeah, she's just doing studies, blah, 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 study to figure out his power. Alright, um, uh, yeah, not this room. Oh, yeah, so just the drawers. Um. Ah, key. Okay. I found a key. Good. It's probably not try the one that's gonna work, but. Uh, There's another drawer. No, no, not there. You don't. Yeah, and oh wait, no, that is the yeah, okay. In, in the bed? Yeah. Yeah, wow, his room is connected to her room, so he can't leave without her knowing. That's depressing. Well, Elizabeth doesn't believe in material possessions, so. Doesn't mean you need to decorate your house. No, no, the bed. No, uh, the bed. The uh, pillow, under the pillow. There you go. Oh, they're so cute. Oh, there was a second, uh. What? In in that room, there was a the the other drawer. Apparently, there's a letter from Karen. She kicked her out of church. Now they're thirsty. Oh, they got kicked out of the church. Okay, maybe the the bottom drawer and the other one. The, 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 that one? Because you pulled the key. I don't know. Okay. Thank you so much for telling me about Daniel. I'm on my way to Haven Point. Ah, I see. Gotcha, yeah. Okay. So that was how she found out about you. Okay, yeah, now you can just go into the office. Hey. I found your letter for Jacob. Too bad Lisbeth found it first. She took it from the mail? Damn no. Is she forcing him to do this? Why is he accepting all that? She took it from the mail? Damn no, woman. Yeah. She no, no, the other car. thing that comes and goes into the community. Just go to the front door. You got the, you have the thing. Is everything all right in there? Yes. Uh, yes. We're trying to get into her office. She's locked it off, so it has to be there. Yes. Yes. That's the one. Oh, All right. Let's get in. Whoa. Is this her personal archive or something? Yeah. She keeps track of everything in here. Stuff about my sister must be in this one. Dang, you saw how the paper like phased through. The yeah. Paper. Okay. Must be what you're looking for. You can still kind of see it sometimes. Yeah. When... She has pneumonia. The pneumonia shouldn't be. Isn't that like something you can get faster? What I get, Elizabeth knows damn well she needs medicine. Yeah, that's the thing, though. That's criminal. She's insane. It, it is something that you can that's not really an issue anymore if you follow the medicine you can take a peek and see how she really treats her flock man what's all this abuse were you like sick conversion therapy that's oh he, he was gay wanted to cure you from 
being pretty much cut freaking conversion again like seriously it, it, so it seems like Donut kind of is maybe they, they're like because that's three games where they basically had like gay people <laughs> I, I'm not saying I mean, they exist the mun yeah, they're there. I know, they're but queer. they made the fact. I don't. I'm not saying that it's it's not the fact that they exist, but the fact that they bring it up and are also talking about the problems that are there from it. Is that they focus on it. Granted, it wasn't much in Life is Strange One. It, 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 the problems weren't there. The the gay overtones are definitely there, but uh. I really did believe I was a sinner, so I thought I had to atone for my sins. Tone. For what sins? I don't get how they can preach this kind of crap. I mean, love is love, man. Are they sinners then? Of course not. I, I just didn't know different, Sean. Yeah, that's the thing. When you're a kid, you have to trust the adults to tell you what's real and what's not. Or at least that's what you do. So whatever they say goes. Elizabeth was very upset. We had a long chat. She told me I should leave. Wow. Go okay, okay. And okay. still, like, god damn it. Kid. Really get hurt in shock. Commit suicide, you're just like, get the fuck out. That's I not. Oh my stuff. god, it's not. I have no clue about your life here. I'm. I'm sorry, Jake. Oh my god. I'm sorry I brought Daniel here. I was just so blown away when I saw what you could do. It was like a real miracle. I, I thought I'd, I'd found my faith again. Instead, I, I just heard him. Then let's make things right. We just have to get Daniel out of here. But you don't want to take the file? I so. And I'll get my sister to a hospital. Have her treated. I hope they'll help her. Yeah. Anything would be better than here. Right. I just hope. Yeah, I mean, I'm sure there's some permanent damage that's been done. What's up? This guy is dangerous, Sean. Trust me. Hey, I have a good plan to get him out of your way. He'll give you more time. Just give me the word. Yes, yes. Yeah. See what you can do. I will. Get ready. Sean, we got him. In the closet. Now. No, yeah, actually, yes. <laughs> Hurry up. Where's the other guy? The fuck? Dude, get in here. This isn't he is he supposed to join me in here? Yes, he should. Uh, go, go go back to the closet. I don't get it. Why is he not following you? Where'd the guy go? Doesn't seem like he's... Is he just standing right there? Oh, yeah, I guess he's hiding behind the door. Huh. That's really weird. Hey, I know you're somewhere in here. And if I find you... Wait, that guy's not the dad? I can't believe if he's Wait, hiding behind the door. Okay, yeah, because it's gonna become a thing where he sees him. Yeah. Oh. Not yet, I guess. Oh, well, let's see what happens. Huh? What, what the fuck is going on? Well, that was close. 
Yeah, I can't believe that freaking work. Do you think it's gotta be Karen? Oh, he's gone. Let's get out of here. So just run? Man, that was crazy. Um. The guy's leaving. Looks like my diversion. You, no, you can search some stuff. Yeah. Nice job. You can find. You can read Jacob's file. Okay. You can search the cupboard to find a file on Daniel, which I think what you just did. Yep. The fuck? What is it? I think that's the file Nicholas had. Take a look. Who's Nicholas? What? Is she trying to adopt Daniel? Exactly. And she's doing it under the table, of course. Take it! Nicholas! <laughs> Okay, so basically you can read Jacob's file if you want. Okay. Otherwise, you can just get out. Are you ready? Yeah, the end is basically get out, and then... So I guess this was prep for the mission to leave? I can't believe this type of shit... Secretive, refuses to compete in sports, shows little interest in girls, questions the scripture, Jacob feels shame. I feel the Lord working through me to save Jacob from himself and the temptation of sin. I've told his parents that he must attend daily prayer sessions with me... Until we have cast out this, this is a test of my faith, I will not fail him or Jacob. Alright, yeah. Oh, shit. Why did Daniel tell her so much? Does anybody else know what he can do? Oh, this is Daniel's file. Personality traits as missing mother? Yes, <laughs> apparently. Pouts too much, spoiled, misses old friends, no lie, likes to watch my servants. Mama's on sick, loves Choco Crisp. Today, Daniel told me about his layover in Beaver Creek. He was hiding out at, my, at his grandparents and made friends with another boy like him. Chris, Chris, of course, he wanted to stay. The police shut up and Daniel wasn't clear about what happened next. I know he's holding back, but the Holy Spirit will free him of his sin of omission. I knew this guy was sketchy, but... Whoa. Oh, I guess that's the guy that just broke yeah. in here. Incarcerated. Whoa, three teener. So he shot. He shot a liquor store owner. Okay, great. <laughs> okay, so yeah, he is dangerous. <laughs> get out. Just get out. Yeah. So we aren't done with chapter nine yet. No. Uh, no. This is. This will be the end. Yeah. Basically, afterwards, you just uh, head back around the front to meet Karen, and that will be the end of chapter nine. Oh. Look at that. Oh, oh shit. Okay. <laughs> yeah, that's a really good diversion. <laughs> Set fire to the freaking church. So we're all good now? I'll go get Sarah Lee while you get Daniel. Then let's meet up at the car, okay? All right. You be careful, okay? You too, Sean. Well, damn. Good luck. <laughs> Jeez. <laughs> well, she wants to make a distraction. Your mom knows how to make a distraction. <laughs> Uh, so head back to the front, yeah, over that way. Come in, Karen. See anything? No, we're all clear. Awesome. Talk later. Run, 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 run. Or light jog. Yeah, this is the front of the church? Yeah, that is. Talk later, and you're literally just running up to her. <laughs> look, look. Mission accomplished? Yeah. Right, what now? Uh, I guess he goes to the church. Did you find what Jacob needed? Huh. And a whole lot more. Thanks for that. Yeah, thanks for the help. A little arson is a good way to make our thing go together. You did well. Hey, I'm here if you need me. I know, Karen. Maybe this will end with him saying, "Mom." <laughs> Enter the church. Yes. Right. Now we're into chapter ten. So you know what you're gonna do? No. <laughs> nope. But let's do it. Yep. That's how these things work. Oh Lord, let your power speak. <laughs> that is not safe. I am your humble sure. servant and will obey your every command. Speak to me. It's Daniel. Speak. I told you. Special. <laughs> I didn't say that. I chose the other one, didn't I? Sean, you came back. And I know. Little cub, come with me, Daniel. We're leaving. I'm sorry, Sean. 
I can't. She's full of shit, dude. And she's using you. Daniel has made his choice, Sean. But I'm offering you to join us again. Put your faith in me, and you'll be family. Never. So that's Wait, that was final. pretty quick. It's a single, single no. It's time for you to leave our sanctuary right now. Not without my brother. I'm not going anywhere. This is my home. She's my family now. Daniel, listen. She's not your family. Who is she? Who is she? Our mother. She came here. For you. Oh. <laughs> She's like, oh shit. <laughs> how do I make this? How do I spin this for us? <laughs> it's all right, Daniel. Go see her. I mean, she's Texas. right there. Don't be afraid. I... Uh, I don't know her. Of course. I know. This is hard for you, my son. Stop calling him that. You're just manipulating him. He's not your son. He's my son. I mean, I, I wouldn't be surprised but if that line comes out. His mother, let me ask you. How could you let your child wander alone in the wilderness where were you when daniel was lost where listen daniel i came here as soon as i found out you were here on your own i'm not my own children are a gift from the lord they are a reward from him you were blessed with a divine gift and you cast him out you into the room away. Who the hell are you? You might have been his mother once, but when you abandoned him, you also gave up your rights. Isn't your God all about forgiveness? You have no idea what the Bible says. You're right. I, I, isn't there also something about false idols in the Bible? <laughs> something about you shouldn't be worshiping them. And your husband to seek out your base desires. Daniel. Honey, she's trying to trick you. Please, think by yourself. You're smarter than this. Daniel. Why isn't she talking? Why isn't he talking about all the files he found out? Happened to your father. You don't know anything. It was an accident. That's what this world is about. Accidents, injustice, pain. I'm just so sorry. Yeah, that you had to do it first. I know. I know how much I hurt you and your brother by leaving. Uh, I don't think this is convincing him. <laughs> yeah, I know. Why shouldn't he be convincing? Like, hey, how about these files that she was testing your shit just to prove that she and she got? How about this letter from the preacher that she got kicked out of the other church? And I'm so glad he listened. I mean, I don't know if that by itself would necessarily also change his mind. It would give him more evidence at least that she's using him. This time, the choice is yours. It depends on how influenced he is by it, because at a certain point you just dig in your heels. I... That's right. You can't tempt Daniel from this garden. He'll stay with us, his true family. And we'll never leave him. Go to him. Ooh. Come on. No! Oh. And the place is gonna light on fire. <laughs> Reverend, are you okay? Nicholas, they're, they're heretics sent to desecrate our, our church. Okay, what now? Don't you understand? This is over, Sean. You have to talk to him. You can convince him, Sean. I won't leave you, Daniel. Not here. Don't be, <laughs> Don't be so stubborn. stubborn. You just got sent flying like fucking. <laughs> Your friend? Yeah, see, now he's gonna start saying all that shit. She's very sick. And Lisbeth won't take her to a doctor. What do you think the all the coughing was? You got Daniel knows who to trust. <laughs> She's not a real Christian. Think about Claire and Stephen. They have faith, but they would never endanger a little girl's life like that. But... She's always right. Why would she lie? Have faith in me, Daniel. 
Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. You totally sound like that right now. I know what I did. Yes, God is speaking to each other. Oh, yeah. She is the She was kicked out of her previous church. Yeah. They knew she was crazy. So she left and founded Haven Point. Why would they do that? Did she do something wrong? Liar. I left on my own because they were all blind. <laughs> That's not a... Yeah, no, bullshit. Nobody leaves the church. Oh, um, the letter from Karen. You can go with that one. I mean... You were the one talking about how, how he should be convinced by the all the information about her testing him. No, no. So I don't know. I didn't. We didn't see his homework. Remember? Except that was the Bible verses. I found a letter from Karen, her mother, inside of her house. She hid it from you, so you never know. She's looking for you. What? You told me she didn't want to see me. <laughs> well, that took a while. See what you have done. Hey, Nano. Back off. No one is gonna keep me away from you. I said, stop. <sighs> Don't. Hey, you got a mash. You just keep hitting A. Eh? <laughs> Well, no, it's just one button. No, you, you, you will have to. Whatever, if I need. Okay. <laughs> All right. No, you got a mash fun. <laughs> to get back up, like. Listen, I did my best job to be a good brother, and I know I probably failed. I took you for granted. I put you in danger. And I'm sorry. Don't listen to him. He left you just he like that you. <laughs> Daniel left him. <laughs> I won't give up on you. Don't hate him. Don't let them do that, Daniel. You're gonna have to keep mashing it again. Yeah. Told you. Yeah, keep doing it. Alright. <laughs> yes, use your power to get up. <laughs> if I could go back in time, I would. We'd be in our living room in Seattle. That would get us pizza and snacks, then pick the movie, because we would always fight about it. He always picked your movie. But I can't do that. All I can do now is fight. Why? <laughs> what are you waiting for? We're the best team in Adam. Stop it! We have to keep going no. forward. What are you going to kill him? Please! It's my brother! You can burn down our church. Yeah, faith of a gun. <laughs> no, you're telling the truth. Gun is good. What was it Zardoz? <laughs> Church of the Gun. <laughs> you won't take away my amendment rights. Nothing. That Nothing. fire is actually Nothing. spreading pretty damn far along the walls. Brother, Dad always said our blood thing was the most important thing. You know. <laughs> <laughs> Daniel, listen to him. <laughs> Just keep doing it. All right. They they like the whole like so there was no psychic there was no special power before the storm right? No. Yeah. That also wasn't done. Not that wasn't. No. Oh. So I think every one of their things has had special power people who <laughs> and I, I guess I mean that's their point but like they, they don't do like walking sims. <laughs> Don't move. Just stop. If you want to kill me, then do it. I'm not afraid. Do it. Do it. Shoot. Don't. Go ahead. What? Shoot me in the face. No. Stop. He's probably took him that long. But he just got knocked over. It's not like even he did anything. <laughs> like, pick up the gun. No, I, that, I'm pretty sure that's what's gonna happen. I was so confused. I thought she was someone else. I'm sorry. It's 
So that wasn't their dad. But Sarah Lee treats him like his dad? We need to get out of here. Now. Let's go. Where did Sarah Lee go? The girl? The woman. I'm sorry, not Sarah. There she is. She locked them in here, didn't they? You started this fire. I mean, he could just blow open the doors. <laughs> Move. Let us go. Move it. You won't leave oh my this God. place. Not with me alive. Oh my God. So you could choose to kill her right now. Wow, why is this one so much bigger? Well, it's just what's the framing. I guess, but I mean, they could still have had the framing there, because normally it's, even, it's always been half and half. Right? Yeah, but like now it's also like Daniel's only in that corner. Yeah, I guess. What are you going to do? Open the door, then. Daniel, after all I did, you can still repent. I don't believe you anymore. Oh, you just dropped the gun. I wouldn't be surprised if she had picked it up and just shot you in the back. <laughs> like, considering how crazy she was, she. I'm surprised they didn't go with that. Like. Yeah. If you threaten her, she just shoots you. And then you start again in the hospital. <laughs> you restart the entire episode. No, no, no. I mean, like, <laughs> just, the next episode also would start in the hospital. Where you and Sarah Lee are both getting kind of checked out. Uh, the problem is now the cops are definitely going to show up. <laughs> Explosion! <laughs> I that's I still think they should have grabbed the letters and it's like if they were leaving anyway and stuff, better to have proof on their shit hands. Like they should have just taken everything. Why? What does she have to go back in there for? I'm so confused why she wants to even go back in. I mean, that's her church. No, I get that, but like, it's not. I, I don't know. I, 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 to run. It's not like there's a person in their that building or anything. <laughs> it's not like she has much else. There's Sarah Lee, and then they're gonna split up. Yeah. A lot of fire in this episode. <laughs> well, you had to get rid of that entire compound somehow. <laughs> Dude, did she, did she just throw a lit cigarette onto the wild brush next to the road? Does she want to create another fire? Is that all she likes to do? Just fire after fire? <laughs> so I guess you're going to Arizona. <laughs> And yeah, music is playing. <laughs> I'm pretty sure music is supposed to be playing right now. Oh, wow. <laughs> no, we're just not hearing it because no more music. <laughs> yeah, so this is the end. That. Ah, so basically three hours. Yeah, I figured this would be longer. I'm surprised we ended it so quickly, so I guess you will get to do your podcast and go to sleep before 3. <laughs> yeah, yeah, let's see the thing break down. Okay. You passed one of the tests. Okay, you didn't pass the other. Most, I, I assume most people fail yeah. that uh, that other one. Uh, you told Agent Flores the robbery was everyone's choice. Yeah, most people sell out Finn. <laughs> Uh, you escaped the hospital without hurting anyone. That you was convinced Joey to help you escape. You attacked Joey to escape the hospital. You attacked the guard. So 
that so see escaping the uh, is from the back this was probably if you just bu- it took that thing like yeah. bust through the front door and hit him and then Joey I guess and for what happened hmm. that was very low yeah see wait he oh if, he if he's dead oh right yeah remember if he's dead he's no need to be at the hospital oh oh well oh cause you went to take it back and he dropped it yeah. right you sang the song in Spanish. You refused to sing up, being up. You were not asked to sing the song. That well, probably would have happened if we didn't. If you did, it. sorry. If we didn't break the toy and like went along with all. Yeah, if you had said the lessons. first, the first two things. Yeah, you got into the truck. You didn't get into the truck and you walked. That was basically just that. Uh, you gave money to the church or you didn't. Most people didn't. Overall, you tried to let Karen Oprah up to you. <laughs> <laughs> okay, most people go in like ninety. Yeah. Uh, you stayed. You stayed outside. outside while she smoked. You didn't smoke with her, and you didn't stay outside. Okay, uh, most some most people apparently asked for a cigarette. You accepted Karen's help. Karen didn't offer to help. I guess that would have been if you had been super hard on her. Yeah. Uh, you got necklace suspicious when sneaking into Haven Point. Oh, I guess that would have been if you um, because, talk to the lady. Yeah, yeah, because you just run right past. You didn't give any money to Jacob. <laughs> Wait, I was going to give him money? That was one of the options when you said, like, we, we, that we should both get her out of here. And oh, you, another right. option was you yeah. can keep my money. Right. Uh, and then you managed to hide from Nicholas. <laughs> and? You and Daniel both spared her life. You shot Elizabeth while Daniel was hurting her. Wasn't hurting her. No, it was. Oh, I, I was reading from oh. just down there. You let Daniel unleash his power. So, what? What? Okay. I'm... I mean, maybe if you threaten, it would just go on, and then that sort of stuff would happen. Maybe? That's interesting. Mm-hmm. Yeah, there were no Daniel decisions in this point. <laughs> I mean, he, there was only, like, one conversation with them at the end, really. Mm-hmm. Oh, they're... The wall! The wall! <laughs> That's a that's a lie that won't. <laughs> yeah, that's a lot more completed than what is. No, I remember when we when we went we down there was a section. I think. Remember when we were at um, Shivani's place? We went down for a bit and we did see like there was a border. There was a wall. Wait, where? I I've never been there when you were there. <laughs> you didn't come with us in California. No, I was in school. Are you sure? It's all you can. Yeah, the one time I went over there, it was at their uh, apartment. Okay, so when we, we went down to San Diego for a bit, and there, and yeah, no, they, um, yeah, there, there was like a whole border crossing and a, and a wall there. Like, it, it wasn't this kind. This is very much the new model that they were testing stuff. Yeah. It was a like solid concrete, like gray oh. thing. Uh, I don't know how far it went, but there was like a checkpoint, and people were going to see back and forth. That was a thing. Okay, what happened? Hide menu. Oh, okay, hide menu. <laughs> okay, uh, but yeah, thank you all, uh, everybody who stopped by. So much, Ryan. Thank you again, Tony three hundred for the bit and Sackrox for the follow. Um, thank you, David. Thank you for being here and occasionally chiming in. Uh, Wow, we met Karen and all that stuff, and now we're going to be going to Mexico next episode. Possibly. Uh, Most likely. I assume that's where it's going to end. We're going to bring the big ladder. (laughs) (laughs) But yeah, thank you all so much for watching, and we'll end this tomorrow night with uh, the freaking ending of this thing. With episode five. And yeah, again, um, these things will be posted. uh, The VODs will be here on Twitch for a week, and then I'll be posting them on my YouTube channel afterwards. Uh, once again, Bowen's, Bowen's YouTube channel, I'm going to post it again, and his uh, podcast name is the Billion Dollar Movie Club. I really should be saying this more often in the middle, but we don't take breaks. So No, we don't take breaks, so we don't pause for like anything. Um, that was like taking breaks, that would be time to plug it in, but like I guess people come back and forth. Um, but yeah, we'll be back tomorrow to finish this game up, and then... I will end the new year, like I said, on Thursday with uh, some Final Fantasy VII.
Uh, and last week's streams will be going, will start going up on my YouTube channel starting tomorrow at noon. I have it set up so uh, it'll be one stream a day. Uh, so if you guys missed the first couple episodes, they'll be coming up later this week. So you can check them out, and then these episodes will come out next week. Uh, but yeah, thank you so much for watching, and we'll I will see, see you tomorrow, tomorrow night. Peace. Bye.